this, fight, isn't it? Sorry, this 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 uh, European Super League thing is it's crazy. crazy. It's crazy, isn't it? I'm seeing I'm seeing the Premier League respond. Brother. I don't know if you guys have seen it. I, 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 I don't know about you, you dad, but I, I'm loving it, man. I'm what are you loving about it? What are you loving about it? Wait, wait, wait. wait. I, I, I was going to say, I was going to say, wait. I love it when the status quo gets thrown off because that, that just means that clubs, they have to pat, I mean, not clubs or governing bodies, they have to pat it up now. And you have to actually give the clubs what they want. Mm. Mm. But is the club what they want good for football? I don't know what they want. What, what do they even want? Yeah, true, true, true. Good point. What do they point, even want? I, I like the idea of the newness and the novelty, but novelty is not necessarily a good thing. You know what I'm saying? Um, but the fact that the, the statement that the Premier League released, they was like saying, we will fight yeah. any proposal that challenges meritocracy and, and people being able to, you know, an open league where there's relegation and promotion. And they're saying that it's a potential threat, this European Super League. is a, The fact that they're releasing this statement, it's real. It's because I've been yeah. hearing about a Super League for God knows how long, but they're releasing a statement and it's real. And everyone's saying that it's going to be announced tonight. This is exciting, but I don't, think, I don't necessarily think it's a good wait, move. Wait, off, off the back of this, right? What's the benefit of the Super League? Just out of interest. What no is the money? Benefit? Just money. I, I, I'm yeah, guessing right. money, right? No. Because it's not, it's because it's not, it's not about. It's not about like the quality of the football that's being played because the teams already in Champions League are there deservedly X Y Z, right? No, I think I think I think it is a money thing, in a way. So I think it's a money. I think I don't like. I I think they don't like the fact that UEFA kind of control their destiny, oh. and I feel like these clubs want more power. Okay. It's the same thing that happened in the Premier League. Do you remember when um, they put a proposal together in the Premier League saying mm-hmm. that? The, the smaller teams should sacrifice part of their vote to the bigger teams. Bigger teams, so the Liverpools, the Man United, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so basically what these clubs are realising is that actually they are the big institutions and Man United don't feel like they should have to answer to UEFA. Barcelona and Real Madrid don't have to answer to UEFA and so they want to do their own thing. Do you know when you, like, when you realise that like, actually we don't need you? I feel like that's what's oh, happening. I'm for it then. And so like, they want to create their own rules. I'm all for it then. Why, but why though? Like you need an independent. You, do you know what I'm saying? Otherwise, they'll create rules to suit them. I think having an independent board to regulate. Do you know what I'm saying? You can't just have these like, especially if you you want to keep it competitive, like the Premier League are saying. You mm-hmm. can't have the big people making all the decisions. Basically, basically running the show. Yeah. You can't. You need an independent. And so, I, as exciting as it is, and as all of this type of stuff, like everybody wants to see a little bit of a shake up. Do you know what? It's like Brexit. Do you know when people just wanted to see a shake-up? They was like, okay, let's see what happens if we do it. It doesn't necessarily mean it's a good thing. And like, as much as it will be exciting and you're like, okay, cool, what would that look like? I do feel like if it's not done properly, then you can definitely affect what is a good... Like, La Liga, I... Because La Liga is... Like, no one's watching Madrid versus most teams. Mm-hmm. Like, they're only going to watch... That's why El Clasico is so big there. Like, Everybody looked at El Clasico like a good thing. No, the reason, the fact that they've only got like two cal- games in the calendar that is like proper high profile, that's shit. Very um, so that makes sense why a, a Madrid and a Barcelona would want a Super League. So there's more games in the calendar that is like proper big. Because even really and truly, the qualifying stages of the Champions League, it's dead. So Wait. really, really and truly, most, most games for Madrid and a Barcelona and a Bayern in the season, they're all dead. Whereas you look at the Premier League, how many match matchups are like exciting? Everyone wants to see Man United versus Chelsea, even though Man United versus Chelsea aren't fighting at the top of the league. But then, like, okay, two questions. So the clubs that are, that are being requested to to join, right? I think mm-hmm. five or six, whatever it is. Mm-hmm. Surely they need proper permission to just. They can't just leave the Premier League. No, but, but you have to understand this is going to run concurrently with the Premier League. So, so, okay, the second question is then, surely the Premier League will basically ask them to say it's us or them because we already get our money from TV right money, blah, 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 right? No, I don't think so because don't forget, what I, what I think is going to happen is the clubs that go there are going to say, we don't want to be in the Champions League anymore. Okay, and that's what, okay. Yes. Because that's hey. UEFA's competition, oh, and they're going to say, "No, we, we want to play European football, but our version of European football will be this European in Super the League." European Super League, okay. And that compromises 
part of what's making the Premier League good because in the Premier League, there's different prizes. There's three main prizes. There's a prize for staying promoted because at the bottom of the league, if you don't, that means you get relegated out of the biggest league in the world, um, football league in the world. And then there's the prize of making it into Europe because if you make it into, sorry, yeah, if you make it into Europe, I'm not just talking about Champions League. If you make it into Europe, then obviously you can get money, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Yeah. Then there's so, so there's another prize that's making it into the Champions League, and if you make it the Champions League, that's the biggest platform of football in the world uh, in terms of like most exciting Champions League nights, etc. And then there's the the main prize of winning the Premier League. But what then, happens but... if there's a European Super League and it's not not open? What you're doing is you're taking away almost like two of those prizes because then yeah, the, because the UEFA competition yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, the UEFA competition has become redundant. Yeah. And it's only going to be necessarily Premier League, winning the Premier League and getting relegation, uh, getting relegated. That's the exciting kind of storylines throughout the seasons. So that affects the Premier League product, which is why the Premier League are going to come out and say, we do not support this. Um, and I think the Premier League may be open to having a Super League, but the fact that it's closed and it's like an invite system rather than you qualify through the Premier League, that harms the Premier League. Okay. And also as well, like that will be the case because the European Super League will only really want the best teams, the biggest. Yeah, teams. but it's not it's not the best teams though because if it's the best teams, then why should it be invite only, and why can't you just take whoever is finishing the in, highest in the, in the league? highest positions? Okay, so not not the best teams, but more like the biggest clubs per se. Exactly, but then that's anti what competition is, right, and this yeah. is why, like as much as it's exciting, is this the right execution? I, like, look, listen, there is a mandate for a European Super League. And the mandate, for my, in my opinion, is, look, Chelsea can win the Champions League this season. Mm-hmm. Is Chem- is, are Chelsea the best team in Europe? No. We all know it. Like, it's an unspoken truth. If you win the Champions League, it doesn't necessarily mean you're the best okay. team in Europe. Because with, with tournament football, you can get these type of things. Because depending on the luck of the draw, you could be on the easier side of the draw. And big teams can knock themselves out. You can find yourself in the, um, the final. Then it could be your day and you win. It's happened to Chelsea before. Chelsea weren't the best team in Europe in 2012. But the, all the stars aligned and we won it. Really mm-hmm. and truly, we don't have a system cu- currently to truly um, filter out who the best team in Europe is. If you have a league format, league formats are much more better at actually finding out who the best team out team of is, the yeah. teams are. Mm-hmm. However... Like, however Tournament football is some of the most exciting football, which is why the Champions League is exciting. Is it necessarily the best at filtering out who the best in um, Europe is? No. If you have a European Super League, then you can actually filter out who the best in Europe is. However, look at um, La Liga. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, Bayern Munich, or look at Bundesliga. Bayern Munich always win the Bundesliga. Does yeah. that make it exciting? Is it like, We all know that Bayern Munich are the best team in Germany. So what? Do you know what I'm saying? I feel like the magic of the Champions League, the magic of tournament football is you don't know who's going to win. The magic of the Premier League currently is you don't know, don't know who's going to win. And so this is why I'm currently, even though it's exciting and it's novel, I'm currently against, especially the way they're proposing it now, I'm against it. But if it does happen, obviously I'm going to have my popcorn there. I'm going to see how it pans out, etc. Yeah. It's interesting, man. I don't know if any of you guys have got any more thoughts on it. I'm very interested to see what the clubs, the English clubs, that are going to be potentially involved. Because I, I just read something that, like, on like the board of the European Super League is like one of the owners from Liverpool, and I think owners from you, know, one of the guys from United as well, are going to be there. So yes. it's just like they're they're supporting it, but they're still part of the Premier League. Like, so it's, I, I'm a you, bit. You, but you have to understand the Premier League. Earlier, if you look at the pre context of the story. Yeah. The Premier League, just last season, they tried to get more power in the Premier League, but that got shut down. And they don't like it. Don't forget, they're these big, like, Manchester United and Liverpool, they're the biggest clubs. And then they've got a small club telling them, like Sheffield United, and telling them, like, no, you can't have five subs. No, you can't do this. You can't do that. And they're like, why are we letting these small clubs boy us? Why are we letting you wait for boy us? So, of course, Manchester United, there's going to be someone from Man United there. There's going to be someone from Liverpool. All these big clubs are basically creating their own thing. I don't necessarily think it's good to give these guys the power. I don't. They shouldn't. They shouldn't be like ruling football. You need an independent body, because otherwise yeah. they're just going to create shit. That's like 
shit like no relegation. Who does that? Yeah, serve? It exactly. serves the big teams. It would just be a, it would just be a monopoly. It's true. You're right, man. Yeah. The question yeah, is, got... go on. Sorry. I've, got, I've got a couple of thoughts on this. You know, I think yeah. um, I think it's about building the best product, isn't it? As you said. So there's something that is lacking in in, uh, in club competitions. Mm-hmm. I think it should be it should be two formats really, um, domestic and then um, and um, European mm-hmm. football, where you have a league format and you have a cup competition format. And for both domestic and European, you have this format. Mm-hmm. Um, how this format gets realised, I I don't know if they want to do it fair because as you said, they have they bring the most money. And they have the same say as someone who, who brings like, you know what I mean, not as much money as them. So they 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 have got a chip on their shoulder. I do think that um it's hard to kinda it's hard to kinda satisfy them all. So that's why they I think they're gonna try use this as a power play to make UEFA change their format. I don't I don't I still don't quite believe that this is gonna happen. I think this is like a big power play. What, what, so if, if, my question to you is: What what are they? What is the power play from them? What what the, do they want from UEFA? The, the power play is to UEFA and the Premier League to showcase we we can get funding. What was it JP Morgan? We can get funding for this league. Um, mm-hmm. If we are teams in this league, they'll all eat well, and your products will suffer if we're in this league, mm-hmm. because the majority of value that you that you have in your league and your competition comes from our teams. Yeah. So if but, they're not here then your product will suffer. You will have to pay compensation to a lot of partners who you promised a certain amount of media value to. A lot of broadcasters who you promised them a certain amount of viewers to. If we have these, these if we have this product where people are going to watch United, people are going to watch Real Madrid, people are going to watch Barcelona, they're coming to us, they're not coming to you. So I get, I get that, you, and that power play is effective. However, however, my question is, what do they want from UEFA? How do UEFA tell them? Okay, cool. That yeah. How do UEFA tell them? Okay, you can have this. What is it that UEFA can give them that will satisfy them? I think I think from the top five leagues, um, it is more places in the league. I think that they're, they're saying it's not properly weighted. They're saying there's teams from lower leagues in Europe that make it into the UEFA Champions League, and even your um UEFA Europa League. And they're saying mm-hmm. these teams shouldn't be in this league, really, because we have teams in our league who can't get into this league, but they're strong, stronger than the teams that we're facing. So, and the big clubs are looking at it quite selfishly. They're saying, listen, I can get a bigger piece of the pie here because of this. Um, like, there's like, a team like Liverpool and United, they don't really struggle making Champions League football, you know? Um, they're, 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 they're making it every other year, they're making it most years. But the share that they get from TV money, from sponsorship deals, it's not the same. But in that league, they have a bit more of a say on this. They're more, they have this say. Exactly. Um, I get that. I get that. And another thing is that I just looked at the people involved. Cronky, the Liverpool guys, the Glazers. Yeah, the Americans. The American business. Is it American yeah. business guys trying to mess up our shit? I yeah, think man. I think it's them three. One one get, Itali- buzzy. get buzzy in here, man. One, <laughs> one, one Italian Don and um, the Uber guy, and then Paris, isn't it? That's Paris. the five. Paris That's the five from Madrid, yeah. yeah, they're, they're mm-hmm. the five that are driving this. It's interesting, man. Fuck. I do think uh, it needs to re- um, re- reform the way um, they do the club competitions and um, European competitions. It needs to reform. I, th- I, don't, I, th- I think it's I think it's outdated. The way teams qualify, it's not properly weighted, as I said. Like in the Premier League, we have eight to ten teams that should, you know, make European places realistically. But those places are not going to the to those teams. So those teams are losing out on money. That's what they're saying. And they're having less control even if they're making European spots. But then but then they're still trying to offer it to like lower leagues. Like the Champions League and Europa League, so that everyone has a is a bit more fair across across the table, no? Yeah, that's what they're trying to do. But th- th- this is this is where the the discrepancy is, isn't it? They're saying, why do we have to compete so hard to get into this competition? Mm-hmm. Um, first and foremost, and secondly, why do we not get enough enough of the pie? So that's just like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. 
I do think that I, I do agree with Dan. It's kind of the wrong way of going about it, but this is this is business for them, isn't it? and they're and they're especially American guys. They're very aggressive businessmen. Yeah, it's true. It's true. They're all about acquisition and takeover and these kind of things. So okay, yeah, trying to inc- improve the product, whatever whatever's there, let's try yeah. and improve it and make money from it as well. Yeah, and it's it's mad because the Premier League is hands down the best league, the most competitive league. Like, mm-hmm. I feel that we'll be doing ourselves a do, do you know what the problem is as well though, for the big teams down, in the down, Premier down. League is yeah go on they're, they're saying I finish here what 6th yeah so I finish 6th and the yeah. team that finished 16th why why is the, the difference in, in what we get TV wise why is this evenly split because we don't bring the same audience mm-hmm. essentially the Premier League product is too fair in their opinion because they're saying I bring this value. Say you bring just have effectively speaking, you twenty, you bring twenty million to the table, yeah. yeah, and you get paid twenty million at the end of the season. But then there's someone else that brings two million to the table and so gets get paid, paid like fourteen. I mean, yeah. <laughs> so you are like this doesn't make any sense. That's not fair. No. Like it's, it's not properly weighted. I'm really interested to see what's going to happen because this is this is big, man. This is big. I don't know if this has happened in another sport when they've tried to like go against a government body like that strongly. Can you guys think of it? No, I don't think so, man. Like all the main sort of sports around the world, they're all kind of governed by independent sort of um, bodies, you know. Yeah. But then I don't know. Like, is is I don't know. Is is the NBA? Is that somehow like some? Is that in some way sort of weighted towards certain certain teams or not? Like, I'm, I'm not sure. No, nah, not really. I don't, I don't know basketball enough to, yeah, not really say that. that. I don't mm. think so, no. A little bit, but I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say it's, it's massive. Yeah. Like, maybe, like, I don't know, maybe, un, you know, like, in the back doors, in the, in, the, in the back rooms, maybe, but not on the face of it. United are heating up here, but they're still not, still not doing too much. Yeah. Dan, Dan. Is it me or you, Dan? No, you Dan, Dan. What did you think yeah. of the Arsenal game today? Crap, man. Yeah? All this stuff about, oh, we had free X- XG or whatever, I don't give a shit. You, you drew 1-1. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> here, 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 here. I, 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 I thought I'd tell I was going to break another record, losing to Fulham for the first time in our home <laughs> in our history. <laughs> I was uh... saying that. I thought this Avengers can do it all, in a Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, great cross. The oh. United game been a bit dead, though, now. Yeah, a bit dead, yeah. They had a, a funny goal disallowed. Yeah. I don't know what Henderson was doing for that. Wild, isn't it? It looks like he's the number one goalkeeper now, man. Long live the gay, yeah? Bloody hell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Brother, done, done out here. The, the one thing I find funny with the Europa, uh, that Super League is that, listen, I, as an Arsenal fan, we, oof, bro. <laughs> I, like, you you like, might have just qualified for a competition, brother. Bro, like I was going to say, people are saying, oh, this is ruining football. Like, I'm saying, this is saving our club, you know? 250 <laughs> M for joining this team. Bro. You might you might not talk about ruining football. This is saving the bro. club. Bro, history, heritage, yeah? We, we Conk is going to slap that into, back into the um, ranks. Um, Straight back into the ranks. Conk is coming to the table with You probably will, energy. but, um, bro, big you might get that odd no signing reason. in, bro. Oh. But come on, man. We are, we are, we are drawing 1-1 one, one up to Fulham at home. Bro. <laughs> so, with Ed, so with, with oh. Eddie and Kaya being our sub, you know. Like, come on, man. Like, this 350 m <laughs> ain't going to be too bad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really no. think it's going to happen, though. I can't lie. I, I no, it's, can't it's, just, can't. it's so aggressive. I think there's too many people that will try to go against it. So. And I, I think someone just put in into the chat that um, Bayern and PSG are, are apparently going to definitely reject any idea of leaving their leagues for it. Yeah, you know what? PSG are rejecting it, though, because the, their chairman, yeah. um, he's on the UEFA board, and he also owns um, B in Sports, who have bought the oh, rights okay. to UEFA Champions League. So he, he spent bare money having the 
TV rights to the FA Champions League. Oh, so now so he, through, yeah, you know it's, not, he's, it's not in his best interest to lose that game. Yeah, not right now. No, not right now. Okay. And then Bayern, Bayern are just... Um, German clubs are different, in it? They have that... They need their fans' approval. And they're definitely not giving approval for this. No, man. How's the TV yeah. rights done in Germany? Is it similar to the way we do it here, or...? Uh, they have, hold on. Yeah, they have the zone in Germany. Okay. They have the right zone. Okay. Mm. It's not obviously not as lucrative as in the prime. It's not. Yeah. It's not on free TV. It's not like Italy, where okay. the games are on free TV. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh man. I wonder what's what is what is it like in France. I don't know if it's on. Free I have TV no idea, or... man. No idea, man. I didn't even know it was still on um, free TV in Italy. That's news to me. That's yeah, crazy. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure Sky Italia is like free TV. Yeah. Even. Ma- who do you think are going to be the winners? Of- Let's say this happens. Let's just imagine it happens. Who do you think are going to be the winners and losers when it comes to like clubs? And let's just stick to the Prem because that's what we're interested in. Arsenal. Arsenal definitely winning from it. So Why are Arsenal winning? Arsenal. Why are Arsenal the winning? Fin- the financial rejection. Arsenal, based on the football heritage history, are being now introduced into Premier Premier European competition. Mm-hmm. When, if you're looking at it on the league table, league table wise, or how they've performed in like the last, let's say, five years, mm-hmm. they've not really put themselves in that in that sort of that question or that uh, that conversation. Excuse me. So, do you feel like Spurs are like a winner for the same reason? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah. Both. Are- I was going to say, both Spurs and Arsenal are benefiting from this because I think definitely. they're both not good right now. Definitely. Okay, so maybe in the short term, as in getting in, they're benefiting. But essentially, if Arsenal are going to be the whipping boys of... Do you know what I'm saying? Would you rather be the king of a small po- uh, pond or the whipping boys of a big pond? Like, is that going to affect their brand if they can't compete at a level? Or do you feel like the more money com- coming in will help no, them compete? The, the more money will allow them to be able to compete at a better level. Absolutely. You bet. But they, they're not going to be able to compete. Yeah, it will, it, it will be. It will, actually, it'll be even more competitive than it is. Exactly. Used. And that's yeah. what I'm saying. So you can have more money, but then well, you're, you're likely to still be the whipping boys of yeah. that league. What, you know what, what are you saying, saying, Dan? Um, f- 50 million on Xhaka rather than 30. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but, but you, you know what I'm saying. You, you know what I'm saying. There are teams that come into the Premier League from the Champions League yeah. and then the, the whipping boys of the Premier League. There's no yeah. glory in that. Nothing, yeah, but I think that league, that, if that league is going to be congested to just 12 teams, which I don't think it will, it'll be like 18. Mm-hmm. I think Arsenal 18? probably be like... Is yeah. there even 18 quality teams in Europe like that? There's, there's already 12 in. You know? <laughs> yeah, and yeah, exactly. And it's twelve in, and it's people that have rejected like PSG and the German clubs. Yeah, so they yeah, they'll have like eighteen that, teams in that league. It's I just going to be diluted, man. That's that's dead, man. And, and I, it's it's all it's all about heritage. I think, as you said, the big clubs buy me buy me. They get there in the um PSG because they they throw the bag. The um the likes of um United as well. Um. Real, yeah, like them, them boys will just be at the top of the table, yeah. Yeah. But the other teams, the other teams will be will, will will have a lot of money from that league, and if they allow to continue in the domestic league, this is where I'm looking at, where you they could have a big benefit, like Spurs or Arsenal, because they have they have significantly more money than the, the teams else. that they're competing with around in the in yeah, the, yeah, in the yeah. Premier League. Yeah, yeah. I hear, I hear. So that that does have a knock up like a knock on on the Premier League, um, because then what happens is just as all of these other teams start catching up and you're looking at and you're seeing like clubs like Everton spending money and they're yeah. spending maybe the same amount as Arsenal, it creates that gap again, which mm. I don't necessarily think is a good thing. But, you know, one can argue, was the league better when there was... Remember when there was that top four and we all knew who the four was going to the Champions League was and those four teams would always compete in the Champions League. Well, not always, but you know what I'm saying? We got to the semi-finals as a Premier League um, I don't know if the league was better then or the league is better now, but I don't know. There's just so many different ways this can go. And I, I feel like, wait, hold up. There's a UEFA statement. Oh, here we go. Because I okay. think they were, go- they were going to announce something tomorrow. All right. So I'll read it out quickly. UEFA, mm. 
Oh, sorry, UEFA, the English Football Association and the Premier League, the Royal Spanish <laughs> Football Federation and La Liga, the Italian Football Federation and Lega Serie A have learned that a few English, <laughs> like a few unruly people, basically, a few English, Spanish and Italian clubs may be planning to announce their creation of a closed so-called Super League. Uh-huh. If this was to happen, we wish to I- reiterate that we, UEFA, the English FA and all of the men, I'm not going to say it again, will remain united in our efforts to stop this cynical project, a project that is funded out, founded out of self-interest <laughs> of a few clubs at a time when society needs solidarity more than ever. We will consider all measures available to us at all levels, both judicial and sporting, in order to prevent this happening. Football is based on open competitions and sporting merit. It cannot be done any other way. As previously announced by FIFA and the Six Federations, the clubs concerned will be banned from playing wow. in any other competition at domestic, European or world level. What? And their players will be denied the opportunity to represent their national teams. What? We thank those clubs in other countries, especially the French and German clubs. Shout out German Dan, who have refused to sign up to this. <laughs> we call on all others of footballs supporters and politicians to join us fighting against such a project if it were to be announced. The persistent self-interest of a few has been going on for far too long. Enough is enough. Listen, oh, oh my God. God. It, it, it ain't happening. Oh ain't happening. my God. Yo. That's, wait, that's wait, what I'm saying. Wait, wait, I, 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 think, I, I still um, think this is just a power play. I can't lie. I think this is a but, big power but play. Then, but, then, like but they're showing that, that maybe they've got the power. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, they yeah. have. To, they're the government bodies that they can't. It's like yeah, it's like F one and the FIA. They always come up very strong, you know. But the power is really with the sport still. It's just more. It's more. It's more difficult in football. But I don't think it will happen. Don't get me wrong. But there will be changes big because of the demands these teams making. I think mm. they have to no, try no. to compromise. No. Wow. Yo, damn. Hey, that statement is fucking. That's that's, a, that's what. That, yo, that that's, is that's, Mars. Um, that's a heavy one, man. <laughs> <laughs> that's Ethan right there, man. Imagine, Boy. imagine that. Imagine how they took that stance on racism, what they just did right there. Boy, boy, you, 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 can, you can zoom, sir. You are <laughs> racist, man. Paying three hundred and fifty yeah, M for, no, for joining. I'm, 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 I'm saying, like, imagine, like, they, they haven't. Yeah, shown, I hear you saying. Shown, yeah, it's crazy. It's, man. Yeah, you're hundred percent right. You're hundred percent right on the racism call. That's a good one. Um, but then, like, oh. I don't know. Because it's do, not hurting do, the pockets. Do these, do these top leagues have real power, though, in the way that this decision making has been made? If you just read that statement, that statement, I don't know. Maybe I don't know the legals. They're going to be exploring. But they, they, no, they, they, they do have power, they but have it's power. just because all, gov- all the government bodies are coming together against them. Like FIFA is saying, and support for UEFA, you can't join the World Cup. So what these teams would have to do is create their own World Cup. <laughs> do you know? Yeah. <laughs> Have to create Chris. everything by themselves. They said yeah. we're banning you from domestic competition as well. They're not in the Premier League no more. Mm-hmm. That's mad. Yeah. How can they do that? Well, it's their competition. It's the the Premier League only competition. This is oh, this so is why. Pre- so it's the Prem that are saying this. Didn't you yeah, read, all like, the leagues together. No, no. I thought I thought you said you. I thought you said you. Oh, so all the leagues have agreed that. If yeah. You, if you pass this of it. Oh wow. Yeah. All of these all of these boards have come together and said, "Bro, we've come together," and yeah. If you do it, then you're not going to be in this, you're not going to be in that, you're not going to be in this. That is mad, you know. Um, how, how, that, that means they, they must have had that statement for a while. There's no way you can, you can, you can just like throw that out. That nah, they, they, they knew this was coming. This has been yeah, they, they must have known it was coming, man. Yeah, it was a matter of time, though. That man said, we're taking your passports, was it? We're taking everything. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's that's the end of that, I guess. <laughs> that's the end of that. Basically, um, as well, because I can't imagine, as well, even players are going to be wanting to participate in yeah, the league. At, that will no forfeit their man. national league, their national team sort of responsibilities. No way, man. No way, man. That, that could potentially mess up football. Um, so, yeah, they've shown... It's a power play, but then they've shown who has the real power at this point anyway. At this what, point, will happen, yeah, for sure. what will happen is they'll go away and then they'll grow and they'll do some more work in the, in the dark. Yeah, this is this ain't done, man. The, and I think this is probably something they anticipated anyway. 
I, I don't think that they haven't come out officially and said this is the Super League format or anything. It's just rumours, you know. They're kind of baiting out the governing bodies, if anything, right now. Yeah. Oh boy, it's gonna be it's gonna be a crazy summer. It's gonna be a whole summer. I still, I still think this is like because obviously the Americans they're used to having like this type of model where there's not really relegation. Um, but I I don't know if it's like I don't I don't really consume American sports like that. But like I said earlier. Like part of the, you know, part of the draw to the league is the relegation battle, and like I think there's a newness in in terms of each single season. You're not only getting new players coming to the league, you're also getting a few new teams. So that's why every single season you look forward to it because there's some new aspects of it. And I don't know if just having like a little bit of new players and the same old team, but I don't know. I just don't like. Mm, I hear that. You know, the, the, for the Americans, though, they're, they're probably thinking, fuck the national sport. They don't care. I know the yeah. World Cup is a big obstacle for in football, and that's a big thing. But they're... Well, I think... Did I drop out? Uh, yes. Is, is Dan breaking up or anybody else or is it just me I was breaking up what's going on with this well, I think you were breaking up a bit yeah, my, my fucking internet is moving crazy today I'm paying well, I can, I'm, I can let you know I don't know what virgin is on man <laughs> Having a jolly. This is mad interesting, though. I like this, man. I, that's what I was saying. I like it, man. I like it when, when things are thrown, thrown up in the air like this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They've just started. Not to, just to continue what Dan Tuff said. I think they've just started there. And they're feeling it out. They ain't trying to do it for 2022. They just yo, started. yo, yo, yo. Can someone can someone read out the clubs that are involved again, just from the Premier League? So it's the top six. I, I swear. To, apart from Man City, isn't it? Oh shit! It's it's the, it's yeah. It's apart from Man City. I just realised that obviously Chelsea and um, Babs will know. We've got Bruce Buck. Yeah. We got Bruce who's that? Buck. He's a he's an American lawyer, but he's, American. he's got, yeah. but he's he's literally like almost like the chairman of Chelsea. So like. Obviously, he's going to be used to this type of system. And obviously, like, in terms of a power play where we don't care about all clubs, it's just about ourselves. I, I, I can see, like, an American theme through this. I, I'm not going to lie. Um, obviously, Spurs don't necessarily have that. Um, nope. but, they're, but they're going to be self-interest too. Um, Man United. Yeah, it's a weird one. And this is why when you're talking about kind of fit and um, proper tests to the owners of clubs, like you kind of have to be like careful who you kind of invite in because they can, they can literally change what has been football history for, for like for since the beginning, obviously we've had to change from like football league to like Premier League or whatever, but yeah, they could mess it up. They can literally mess it up because fans can decide we don't like this new thing. We don't like it. Uh, I don't know. They can mess this whole thing up. So who are the six English teams that have City it's and five, not It's I think it's five. I think I've read Boy, it's looking like a sticky one still. Yeah, I think it's five. I heard it's five anyway. <clears throat> What's the United game saying, though? I, I haven't been watching. It's half time, man. It's not been nothing's going on. Yeah, it's man. pretty boring. It's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of boring. It's, it's, it's kind of almost boring, an man. advert for a European Super League, right? <laughs> Bam! <laughs> <laughs> dead, brother. It's dead, it's dead, it's dead, it's dead. Oh, my God. We'll see. Maybe UEFA need to say, okay, cool, let's... Let's play with these guys. Let's try and do a, a European Super League. Because I feel like if we can do it where the, it's not closed. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. I, I like the Champions Yeah, I, I feel like qu- qualification should, it would make it a lot more interesting. Qualification will. Having... Qualification will. But I do think... I think... Um, the, do you remember how the FA Cup used to be a big thing in England? But I think ever since um, the European Cup is in the Champions League, as when that kind of grew in prominence then I think the FA Cup lost its magic. And I feel like in football, there's space for one domestic tournament where it's like everybody yeah. wants to win it. 
And if we do have a European Super League, then maybe there is, I don't know how we do it, but there's going to be space for a tournament football because I feel like tournament football is so good. It brings something different. Um, I don't just want to see league football in, in club competition. I like, I like tournament football. Gary Neville. Gary Neville thinks he's the best of the people, the everyday maybe, man. Maybe they should do like every two years, like this this tournament that they do, you know, or you know, like in the summer they do this tournament now, where yeah, all the but... teams that try qualify for they teams are qualifying for it for um over two years, and then they do it like like the Euro European Championships or World Cup. Like, like our every two the years. Like yeah, our of the playoffs. I think that will work. I think that will work. <laughs> I feel like but the problem is after a long season you don't get the best football. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. If it's like okay everything's done and in in the summer when people should be resting you're doing a tournament. I don't know. Obviously that's how international football works, but international football international football is the inferior product. And even like in in terms of like the tournaments in the summer, it only really warms up in the final stages, really. Yeah. It's just because everyone is involved. Everyone supports someone. Yeah, know? and it's the, it's the novelty of like, okay, cool. We don't really get to see competitive international football like this often. Whereas we get Every to four see... four like, years, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we get to see competitive club football all the time. So a summer, a summer tournament, it's like, ugh, I don't think it will work that way. But I feel like, I feel we defo need a, to- we need, need a tournament. Um, mm. we, we, we can't just have leagues. I, I think I think UEFA are on the ropes to be honest. Mm. I think they're on the ropes, man. Yeah. Because I think the repercussions of like even if they got FIFA involved now. I was saying that if you if your players are playing in this league, yeah. you're not playing for your national team. Players players will boycott and say why? I'm because I'm playing in this league. I'm not supp- I'm not allowed to represent my national. But do you know what I mean there's there's going to be so many repercussions that. This is this is what I was saying. Like, why do then do they feel like if they put this to the teams that are involved in this Super League, what like what power do these teams think that they have over it? Like, why wouldn't they be able to do what they want? I, I don't I don't really understand why. Mm. Yeah, sure. I don't know. I kind of you know the more you, when I think about what you said, Dan, I'm kind of I, I might actually be behind it. Like, it could be a power play, brother. Yeah, I think I think it is that, yeah, like the fact that just because Chris was a Chris Wilder, that was the one world that decided that you can't have five subs. That must infuriate that man. <laughs> like, who the hell is this guy? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. You're getting in my way. And Sheffield United are now getting relegated, and he he what what he decided they're not going to vote again on it this summer. It's, no. just, it's been decided now for a few years because he was against it. And the team are going down the year after. I think that's what they're, that's what they're, a lot of these clubs are saying. Like, we don't have enough influence, enough say, but we hear basically every year. We don't, mm-hmm. We're not going anywhere. You're, 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 you're making use of our IP. You're making use of us, making money of us, and we don't have no say. We have nothing to basically give, yeah, bring to the table for it, yeah. I, mean, I like this, man. How, how do you think, well, how do you think teams the dark outside, points. like, how do you think teams outside the top six will feel about this, though? I think they'll be, they'll be against it, man, for sure. But then surely, get... surely they're to gain from it if there's potentially a situation where the, the traditional top six are not in the league, no? Mm, that's a good point. I think it's one of the ones where, yeah, they might they might gain from it, but you know, the prize money for getting fourth will change with yeah with the top six not being here. You know, the absolutely. league will just lose relevance. So absolutely, absolutely, that's it. Whereas, it? like before that, you were playing in the league that is the best league in the world, and then now it's one it's one of the domestic leagues because <laughs> the main league is something else. You know, people might watch you on catch up. You know, rather than watch you live. Live exactly. Like BT Sport highlights and that, rather than full ninety minutes. I still think this can't really happen. I'm be surprised. BT Sport highlights. Be dead. So what was that? City are involved. Bro. City are involved. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, I, ain't lying to I think it's the to- the whole top six. Yeah, man, has to be. What's happened with like, um, oh, I don't know, financial fair play? Are they still running that? See, they made that redundant this summer, didn't they? Sorry, because of COVID. Yeah, they made oh. that redundant this summer because of COVID. Oh, I think that's okay. that's the game. One of the reasons why they're like the big teams are against UEFA so much because they put this financial fair play in. Mm-hmm. Making it more difficult for them, do you know, to to do whatever they want to do. They want basically, yeah, yeah. Do you know what? Like, it's mad. I, I reckon the top six, they know what they're doing, man. Yeah, I think I think they have got a proper plan. Yeah, they they. I imagine they would do, man. Because at the end of the day, bruv, if you've got the most power, you can create, you can easily create a, a monopoly, especially in this country, especially in this country where the competition is high, but the outcome is still largely the same, brother. Mm. It's still largely the same. Let's be honest. Like, apart from, let's say, Bar Leicester, right? How many teams have really competed outside of the traditional top six? And nope, there's none really. Exactly, exactly, exactly. But yeah. Hold on, I'm just reading some of these things. I just see, I just see, Cron- Cronk is involved in it. I'm against it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm against it, man. Hey, Conk is a cook, brother. It's, yeah, it's, I, 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 it's just for me. I'm not against it or really for it. I'm just interested. I'm treat. I'm intrigued by it. I just find it so. I find it interesting that people are so quickly against it. Why though? Why are you so? Why are we against it? Conky, I think Demsoff gave some gave some good points. To be fair, mm-hmm. in terms of like excitement and stuff, but I'm always intrigued by new things, by new formats. So I'm not really against it. I'm not really for it. I kind of want to see what happens. I I thought everything Dan was saying actually it sounded like it sounded good but as soon as I heard Conky's involved I'm I'm completely against it now. That time, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't like that man. Hey. Whatever he's on, I'm not. Yo Dan, what's your what's your take on on Conky? I think he gets um, a lot of unfair criticism to be fair. Okay, okay. He, he's not he's not a, he's not a great. Don't owner, defend don't, that man. No, don't get me wrong. He's not a great owner. Like by any stretch of imagination. Wait, like, wait, 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 wait. But... Moises, sorry, sorry, Dan, sorry, not you. Why are you against him? After Dan, just tell me why are you against him. Okay, he's ruining my club, man. He's ruining my club. I don't care about the things he's done. He's, he's ruining my club, man. He's made me hate football. That's... I can't lie. Arsenal, Arsenal have spent a lot of money to just spend on the wrong players over and over. So he doesn't give us money, but we we have a we have a self sort of sufficient. Um... Yeah, but is that allows us to spend money? Here's the thing. Here's the thing. We've always had, we've always, we've always had a self-sufficient model, yeah. But we didn't have an idiot running it. Do you know what I mean? Like David Dean did what did what he did with scraps. But 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 Conke is not the one doing transfers, mate. He's just he's not. He's not. He's not. Is he? It's he's not. But he's he's there in it. Like the guy's a blame. I just looked. I was pointing to him. I was pointing to him. Yeah, I, I think it's too, I think it's too easy to blame him. Whilst I don't to... think he's a great owner, there's there's better owners out there who form. inject who inject funds like the Everton owner, for example, injecting funds. I think um, that the Arsenal leadership in general has been quite poor. Um, yeah, granted, he has, he has he has he has assigned some of these leaders, but um, yes. he, he he's not responsible directly for Gazidis. No, absolutely not. Getting 100 no, he's not. He's not, but he's Gazidis Gazeta, Gazeta's making signings that Wenger doesn't approve of. Like all this stuff is that's not with Conker. He lets people he lets the Conker, people Conker. do their stuff. And mm. even even Raul, like Raul was here for a year and they realized, okay, this guy's a crook. So um um so, um we were got hired by Gazidis and they fired him. The investigation was <clears> it was quite clear that they were thought, thinking he's doing a lot of illegal stuff, so or back back end stuff. So they investigated all his transfers and Ended up had had to leave as part of the people that got made redundant, which is that's the way that officially wrapped it up. But as for me, it's quite clear that he it looked like he was doing a lot of things that he should he shouldn't shouldn't be doing, and they're just for said now nah, we we're doing this investigation, getting them out. Um, I yeah. think I think I think they're okay on us. They're not great, but <coughs> a lot of the blame must be attributed with actually like Gazidas. I think has got a lot of blame for the um, last. You can, you can attribute you can attribute some blame to Con Cronky as well because. If you look at the original statement he made when things started going bad, well, when things were going bad early on, he said that um, Arsenal fans shouldn't expect... Uh, sorry, pardon me. Arsenal fans shouldn't expect, like, any, like, massive, like, investment or, like... He basically came out and said, like, I can't I can't quote him word for word, I have to paraphrase it, I remember reading the article, like, a while ago, 
and that was that was those are his words. No one, no one's putting them for him. So like, it's yeah. for him to, to to hide behind people he's hired and that kind of stuff when he in fact of feels like the same way that we should be. Like, I think it's got hopes up basically. He basically told us let's get our hopes up and we should just like take success where we can. And that for me, yeah, that's very bad. bad. I think he, been, I think it's, it's clear that it's, it's, I think it's quite clear he's a passive owner. And yeah. I, I, whilst I don't agree with him being an owner, I also don't agree with shouts for um, Usman or whatever his name is, or Dangote. People just because because he will put money doesn't mean he will be a good owner. These type of owners, they could just leave. They could have a short term interest in this and then lose the interest and wreck the club. So um, I, I don't agree with any of those choices. I think. <laughs> What I would like to happen is if, if one of the Qatari guys takes over because these men are in for the long haul. Any, yeah. any, any, any yeah. sponsorship deal they do, yeah? You know how people usually do like a two, three year, maybe four, five year deal on sponsorships? Yeah, yeah. yeah? the Saudis, they do a 15 year deal. Mm. 15. <clears throat> so they're really in it. They're really in it. They're really in it, yeah. So, so wouldn't we're, mind. We agree this is, it's, it's not Dangote, but it's definitely Kronke out. Yeah, I, I, I want to own a put money in like, for sure. I just, my guy, yeah, I don't know. My guy, my guy, I don't know. You can't be, you can't be uh, putting no money in, man. For me, that, for me, that's shit. <clears throat> that's poor. What do you think about um Levy? Um, I. Um. Okay, so for a long time, I was against him. I was very much Levy out. Um, I felt like he was somewhat handicapping the football club, even though he had taken it sort of leaps and bounds. But now that I look as in my like older sort of mind as a Spurs fan, I actually see the bigger picture. And I just feel like in the long term, he has taken this football club leaps and bounds. I mean, people talk about Tottenham not winning X, Y, Z on the football pitch, not producing blah, blah, blah. But as a football club, our profile and our trajectory has actually been upwards for the last going, I'd say, 10 to 15 years. And I feel like whilst people will look at football and always want to see what's happening on the pitch right now, he's probably been looking at it as in like, I will try and put the things in place to allow us to be able to sustain that level when we can finally do so. I just feel that in the short term, he's made lots of stupid errors and lots of mistakes in terms of play recruitment. Um, also in terms of supporting the certain managers when certain managers were needed. And also lots of like decision-making at, at the higher sort of ends of the club. So things like losing top scouts, top recruitment guys, um, Everybody knows like how well documented that Tottenham were literally, in my opinion, two or three players from being a top, top side with Pochettino at his height after the season after we were unbeaten at home and came second. But looking at it now, I mean, I feel like he's made a big, big error by trying to almost keep the fans on the side by getting Mourinho in and giving Mourinho money and trying to get something short term, trying to win something short term. But I think if if anything now, it's backfired. I arguably look mm. at us as a football club on the footballing side, and I think we've regressed. We 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 are we are behind where we were with Pochettino now, and mm. I feel it's going to take a long time to fix not only the squad, but again like lots of different things with regards to this this the football mentality that we have at Tottenham. Because I feel like there's everything's there, man. I feel like training ground is good. The academy is very very good. The stadium is unreal. The money will be coming in. Like we have been progressing and playing in the in the sort of the sort of premier competitions in the last few years. So it's not as if like when when we we're not moving in the direction. We are moving in the direction, but we're just making stupid errors on the footballing side. And he's gonna really. I really. I've said this. He's gonna pay big time for for sacking Pochettino when he did, and putting Mourinho in in that position because Tottenham needed someone who was gonna effectively continue the work of Pochettino even if Pochettino at the time he was in a bad way he like he probably took us as much as he could he had his cycle but we needed a manager that was going to try and progress the football club in an upward trajectory like the way the football club's been run but with Mourinho he wanted a really a stopgap someone who's obviously a proven winner but at the top level honestly can't 
we can't do it. And I feel like now we kind of need to just start again, man. Like, I just, because mm. I was saying earlier on, like, the squad is not bad. I tell you, two, three, two, three players improve the squad and five or six players that leave. You have a completely different outlook on the kind of team that we are. But at the moment, and I've said this before on like the pod, we are a first team with many squad players playing in the first team who shouldn't mm, be in the first mm, team, mm. in my opinion. That's fair. That's fair. I think I think Levy is um he's good at building the Spurs product as in like yeah. you look like a like a football club for me and like a big football club bigger football club from the outside now. Yeah. But yeah, if the football indecisions he, he, I think yeah, it's clear that some of the football indecisions shouldn't be with him. But he I think he's a fan that has managed to be um just club for this much that he now wants to be, you know, at, at the heart of making Basically, decisions. Basically, yeah, you know, and you know, and, right, and rightly so. If you've been doing this this whole time, you've been making big decisions, and you feel like you've taken them forward. Why wouldn't he want to be like? Yeah. It, did you watch the? Did, did you watch the? Uh, the Spurs yeah, I watched. Uh, I watched like, them. You, yeah, you yeah. could see, like, even as a football fan, he was completely overawed by Mourinho, like almost obsessed with him. He wanted to be yeah, liked by was, him. You know, he, he was he was awed by him. And mm-hmm. it's like as a as a as a lower level example, if you start a Sunday league team, yeah, yeah, that Sunday league team does well for yeah. ten years. You're like decent, uh, um, you're not that great, and then you do a few things that really elevate your team, and all of a sudden you like you like semi pro, like, yeah. you know, and then um, all of a sudden you're competing for a few trophies. You're not really winning anymore, mm-hmm. you're like competing, and yeah. you're still the guy running the show and pushing the club forward. And in, in your in, in your in your opinion, do you know, and yeah, you're achieving things like. Like with the stadium, with sponsorship deal, because there's a lot of things that he's achieved on a commercial side. He's not going to think. Listen, I need to get someone else. He's going to think. I'm, I, need, I need to still actually, yeah. And and this is what I yeah. think he needs to understand. Like I'm not a, you know, I'm I'm no director of anything. But I just what I need to, what I need to like fit to see is that he needs to be given the confidence that actually he can actually hire the right people to do that for him, mm. and people will still yeah. respect him and keep him in. Oh, it's a great. Great That's dummy, a good goal. great dummy from fuck, fuck you know. What Bruno, man? yeah. That's good play, that. That's good play, man. Well done. Look at Fernandez, man. Fuck you know. Yeah, like say he's kind of in the mindset that he has to be actively involved, but it's not a bad thing. People won't look at you differently if you recruit the right people to do those jobs, and you're still the main man. You know. Yeah, like like, like what Roman is doing. Basically, most, like, most people, part. people don't understand like what Roman has done at Chelsea is phenomenal. Chelsea are perennial winners. They're perennial winners in the, in the English league now. Like, we think about the 21st century, what Chelsea have done in the last mm. 10, 15 years. It's incredible, despite all the things that's happened to them as a football club. And they still have the same owner. The same owner. Yeah. Mad. Who are you talking about, man? Who's this? Some Raya. You know it is, man. Yo, what are you saying? Man? <laughs> <laughs> you know exactly what it is, man. You know exactly what it is. All right, boys. I'm all right. How's it going? Oh, yeah. So you're winning. So you're winning. So you're winning. What's good, brother? Nice little yeah. goal, brother. Nice little goal. Oh, I swear to you, I hadn't even seen the goal. I just got in. Yeah, yeah. It's a nice goal. Who scored? Yeah. That time is impeccable, man. Greenwood. I swear to Money you, mate. I Money just mate. came in. I just came inside. Asked Dan and Luke before the pod, I said I wouldn't be able to get here till the start of the second half. Yeah, man, money makes Every it. time. They, they knew I was coming round, so they had to fix up, man. How was it going? <laughs> How was it going? That was a good yeah, goal. Was good, but it didn't it was fix up. They didn't fix up for very long, because I've just tuned in, and it's one off. Oh, <laughs> oh, my God, oh, what? No. I said, oh, you're no. a villain, you know. Oh, no, you're a sir. villain, you know. <laughs> Thank you, I know man said that with a smile on his face. Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> bow, bow, bow. Bow, bow, bow. That's an unfortunate turn of events. What is, why is Henderson wearing a hat? What is going <laughs> on? I know Henderson wearing his crap, man. I don't give a bow, damn. Bow, bow, bow. He's wearing a hat. Bow, bow, bow. I know that's not a Liverpool fan. My stream is still nil nil still. Yeah, my stream's still nil nil. Forty six minutes. The game just started, man. Just, 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 just heating up for you. Heating up, Maguire. Go like though. 
My boy got dunked on, innit? Man, yeah, he did. That's his one job. That's his one job to fucking mate. fucking head with his slab head. Don't even do that's that. That's it, man. Joker. Got dunked on by his age mate. Still got fucking dunked on balls in his face and everything. Fucking. Oh, slap. all right, man. Oh, 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 oh. You good, Andy? Oh. Yeah. Hello, you watch the semi-final, you come out of your fucking hello, ditch. Hello, sorry, sorry, hello, brothers. Let me start down, that again, hello, brothers. Yeah, I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't lie to you, man, on this one, man. Rashford absolutely dusted their right back, boy. Oi, that was a quality goal. Yeah, it was. Fucking hell. Rashford fucking dusted their right back. Jesus. Come, let's just look at this. Hey, Rashford dusted their right back. Fucking hell. Yeah. What's up, seeing the Maguire? Someone sent me a fresher link in it. Just want to see this Maguire gaff. Yeah, he got. Now switch yeah. to, I switched to real time. I do it, so you know. Nice one, brother. Oi, fucking source the right back. Are you nuts. Maguire, you right. from Bruno. Maguire tried to call the charge. German Dan. That's a great finish. Yeah, that's good. So, quick question. Did you celebrate like your, your colleagues over at uh, Arsenal Fan TV when you scored? Nasty. <laughs> no, Harold. I, <didn't> <laughs> I said nasty. Nasty crew. T, T, T. <laughs> I, I did not, brother. You didn't, no? Oh, okay, cool. Let's check it in here. German Dan celebrating that Super League money, man. Yeah. Boy, that, that, that's, that's what I'm celebrating. <laughs> why, why are you man in that? What, guys are, talk, guys are talking, talking about the friends. Listen, talking listen, hey, league. all you man always ask us, are you a top six club? Ask me again. Nice. <laughs> Heritage, heritage, heritage. Respect. Heritage League, only respect. Respect. Not chat to me if you're not in the Super League, please. Yeah, respect, please, respect, please. Respect. Yeah. I can't believe the man got in. Being in that team may just get you banned from everything at this point. <laughs> <laughs> it's not looking worth it. Oh, fuck you now. Let's see how they fuck this. Hey, listen, listen. The Premier League ain't worth it for me right now, bro. It is what it is. Mm. It is what it is. Conky front and centre, though, isn't it? Yeah, I I think all the American owners are drivers of this, man. Yeah, man. This is the Cronky, film, man. That's their thing, isn't it? The franchise model. Yeah. Cronky yeah. saw Jamal Murray go down. He's like, ah, let's put one more effort into this Arsenal thing, innit? Let's go again. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Hey, fucking Wait, hell. Jamal Murray, has he actually got his ear? Think so, yeah, 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 Oh, Maguire did get dunked on. Fuck, you know. Hey, you um, know who else is playing really well in the Nuggets? Who? MPJ. Oh, yeah, 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 for sure. He's playing we, really well. Can we get a time check? Uh, 53, 40. Yep. 53, 40. You lot, post that in the chat. Post your times in the chat. I don't know where I'm up to. Fuck. Oh, fuck, you're killing me, man. You watch that TV, though? I'm 54, 13. No. Now TV, now TV, bro. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, you're like a minute ahead, uh, Sam. And and Stan. You're not at oh, 55 man. original Ayub, man. Shut up, man. <laughs> I said he's in the future, you know. <laughs> Scary shit. How was the first half? Oh, it was dry. It was dry. It was dry. It was boring. Huh? Boy, this Henderson brother is funny. Oh, Henderson is mad. 2-1. Nah, I don't know what this brother is doing, you know. But is he having a, is he having a howl today, yeah? Yeah, he's, 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 he's rushing off his line. This is the second time he's rushed off his line very, very early. In like, first time... He's trying, trying, trying to be assertive. Trying to be assertive, yeah? Gotta still got to have some sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put the anti-TDG, yeah? I hear it. So what? Is the guy done then, yeah? Uh, yeah, brother. He's done. Okay. Yeah. He's saying there's Luis done. Bro. Yeah, man. It's done, bro. Mm. <laughs> uh, well, I was going to ask you your thoughts on the performance against um, Everton, but we'll save that for the pod, eh? Yeah, bro. Uh, nice one, brother. Uh, I, I suppose in the Super League. Yeah, top, top, brother. The whole okay. top six is in. Yeah, we're oh. eating. 
leaving them, man. Yeah, there, there you go. Levy secured his directorship for another me. decade. They said, three, they said 300 million on entry. That's that's wiping out certain clubs whole debt. <laughs> but we'll leave it there. Uh, it's, it's COVID that's brought this around, isn't it? Must what I'm interested to see is if it becomes an add-on onto, onto Champions League and League, or if... Because, what, 12 teams initially? That's a lot of home away. That's a lot of games, man. I'm going to be interested to see how they fit that in. To be honest. Boy. I'm buying Bappy. <laughs> right, I've got the wrong group chat, yeah, with West Ham fans in the bro. These men are fucking. <laughs> what? Because no, no, they're fuming what? about the Super League thing. <laughs> Why? West Ham fans need to behave, man. They're like... <laughs> Support <laughs> fucking West Ham, <laughs> man. Behave, man. Just be happy you're a bat. I'm seeing, I'm seeing bare fucking signal words about elitist and hey boy. <laughs> <laughs> the men of press, elitist corruption. Mm, the, game's oh, gone. Oh, the game's gone. Lack of integrity. Oh boy, I love that one. Okay, they, they, they love the game's gone, man. They love it. <laughs> I love it too, brother. I love it too. <laughs> yeah, I can't lie. I, I indulge that with myself, man. <laughs> hey, interesting. Oh, super league, yeah. Well, how do you not feel? How do you, so for those of you who apply to that is your thoughts on it? Like uh, your first thoughts anyway. Yeah, I these other man talk because I think me and me and, me and Tops were talking about this for a bit. Okay. What do you think what do you think, Babs? I like it, man. I like where things get shaken up. But I think it's a bit dodgy that they've done it like mid season. I think that's a bit um distasteful. Oh you say mid season, there's like six eight league games. Yeah, I know I know yeah, but I know but like Come on, at least wait till the end of the season, you know. At least wait. Have some decorum. Mm, I hear it, man. Did COVID have decorum? <laughs> <laughs> what? Did, you have, hey. did COVID have... This, COVID is the main reason why this ha- is happening. I'm asking you, is hey. did COVID hey, have decorum? Hey, hey. If anybody's listening, I, I ain't involved with this conversation now, man. I'm just, <laughs> it's just a, a question, brother. The answer is no. Basically, I'm going to say you got to strike while the iron's hot. Wait. <laughs> Fair enough. But it is what it is. We'll see. They're saying you wait for and crash, crash, crash meetings as we speak. Mm-hmm. Did you see the statement? What did they say? Oh, it, it was a hot one, man. It was, what was it? it? We're talking, we're talking EFA. We're talking EFA right now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> We'll see, but they, they, you need them more than they need you. Mm. If I'm being honest, so I'd be interested to see. So what does the comment? What does their comment say? Do you want me to read it? Yes, please, brother. One sec. So it said you wait for the um, English Football um, Association and the Premier League, the Royal <laughs> Spanish Federation, okay. and the Liga, okay. and the Italian Federation, okay. and the Serie A. Okay. Our plans to announce the creation of a closed budget so-called Super League. If if this were to happen, we wish to reiterate that we, UEFA, the English FA, the the Spanish Royal Federation, the um Italian the Italian League, all these other leagues and the Premier League especially, will remain united in our, in our efforts to stop this cynical project, a project that is founded <laughs> on the self in <laughs> on the self interest of a few clubs. Yeah. At a time when he needs solidarity more than ever. We could, we will consider all measures available to us at all levels. We're well, gonna force them to stay in your leagues, yeah? Okay. Wait, look, keep waiting. Both judicial and sporting in order to prevent this happening. Football okay. is based upon competitions and sporting merit. It cannot be any other ways. As previously announced, the FIFA and the six federations, the clubs concerned, will be banned from playing in any other competition at a, at a domestic, European, or world level, as well as their players denied opportunities to represent their national teams. We thank those oh. clubs in those countries, especially French and, Ger- French and German clubs, who refuse to sign up to this. We call on all lovers of football, supporters, <laughs> and politicians to join us in fighting against such a project. Politicians, Mental. yeah. Mental. Boris Johnson, yeah. <laughs> so they will literally ban clubs and players from like from taking part. Interesting. Yeah. This is getting spicy, boy. Spicy indeed. I haven't heard your your thoughts. 
Um, I, I haven't had time to process it, but first thoughts are, um, I get it from the club's perspective. It, they are the drivers of these leagues. And if their, their clubs are on the, on the ropes, they have to be seen to do everything. This is what happened in time. Things grow, things change. That's how the Premier League started. That's how the Champions League started. Um, wow. The idea is what, 12, wow. 12, 12 um, clubs that are in it continuously or so. And then what, like six to eight who have to get in there via like competitions? I hear it. And I'd love to see Manchester United versus Real Madrid regularly. Uh, Manchester United versus Atletico Madrid, Manchester I'm United sure versus AC Milan, sure Chelsea. Yeah, I would. I would. I'd love to see the, the big players on the biggest yeah. stage more regularly. Um, it kind of renders, ooh, Rashford, it renders something like the Champions League a bit, yeah, pointless because if, if I'm getting those weekly in my Super League, the Champions League is, is less prestige. So we'll see, man. Okay. These clubs need money, man. All right, so, but I'm not, <laughs> I'm, maybe there's an echo from me. Maybe it's me. Let me mute myself. Okay. Um, what do you think for the football fan, then? Do you think, we're, like, if this happens, do you honestly feel that, like, even as a United fan, you can be selfish and just think about United. Do you think it's a better product that we'll be receiving from what you know? So, so, so imagine you, you, there's no Champions League. You're out of the Champions League. If the, all of these boards are going to come together and you're out of the Premier League too, and all you're seeing is this Super League, um, do you think that's a better product? Yes. Uh, explain that to me, Amara. Explain it. Because uh, you watch American sports. I don't. So maybe you've got an insight into the world. No, for What's me, I, it's, the be- it's the best of the best against each other. I like the, I like the I franchise thing. I can't lie. I, can't, I like the franchise thing. It's yeah, the best no. of the best. Like, when, we, when we watch these, when we watch the, the Premier League, uh, a good chunk of the games are, are, are us mostly on what how the teams play. But I, I want to see my best players against your best players. Yeah, I think it could be sick, man, think... in terms of spectacle. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay, so... I think the impact it has, has on club football overall, not good. But in terms of entertainment, I think it would be sick. But don't you think the variety of competitions that we have now add to the calendar? Because, listen, we do, we do football talk. Do you know what I'm saying? So we get together and we talk about football and there's Champions League football and there's Premier League football and there's domestic cup football and there's, there's a lot of football... For, for the consumer, because we talk about it every single time. Whereas if you're, you're talking about it and you're getting rid of all of that and you're just creating a Super League and maybe they play, play once every single two weeks, is is that something that you'd like to see? Say that again. Sorry, my connection was a bit iggy. Yeah, what I'm saying is, like, because obviously there might be 18 teams in this league, there's yeah. not going to be demand. Cups. There's yeah. not going to be. Do you know we've, we've got so many different layers. Yeah. I explained it earlier in terms of even just the Premier League. You've got the fight for the actual league. Then you've got yeah. the fight for the Champions League. Then you've just got the fight for the Europe, for Europe. Then also what you've got is the relegation battle. So there's four different strong storylines to follow through a, a league season, and just, that's just the league. You've also got other leagues you can follow, so you can follow those. And then also you've got domestic cups you can follow. And so what I'm saying as the football fan. There's so many different iterations of football. Plus, you've got the Champions League there too. And as a football fan, we, we do Touchline Fracker. We do a weekly podcast. I know, obviously, they do podcasts in America for American sports yeah. as well. But we get so much football. And I think that's superior than just once every two weeks. Oh, it's Real Madrid. Like, do you know what I'm saying? I, I don't necessarily see Yeah, I don't know. I don't, personally don't care about the cup competitions. We don't really, even from our perspective, we don't comment on the relegation because those teams don't nobody cares like their fans care and that's cool but nobody really cares that it's the top teams that people want to watch it's the top teams that people want to talk about and it's the best players that people want to talk about so watching that week in week out for me sick and and if if the money has coming into this means that the best teams get to get even more of the best players so be it the rest of you can fight over whatever's left man rest in piss no, so my thing is when you say nobody cares i don't necessarily think that's true because I think it's, for me anyway, I care because of the variety that's provided. So I'm someone, like, I like novelty. I like a winning, for, um, I like a winning formula, but I can't just see that winning formula all the time. Now, if we were to have this new competition, there will be variety in terms of there will be new people coming to the league. There'll be different personnel, exactly. You get new managers coming in, you get new players coming in. But I like the idea with the Premier League that a new team comes up 
that we haven't seen for at least a season. How would they fare? You know, we just, I don't even know about these players, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. It's that novelty that the Premier League brings. What by every single season having like three new teams in it. Um, I don't know. I don't know. It's maybe it's difficult for me because I don't consume American sports. But maybe the reason why I don't consume American sports is because of they don't really operate. I like an open system. Yeah, that's fair. I guess I guess I want to hear from the, the chat as well, like what you think, because obviously me and Mariah are providing different points of view. Yeah. Um, but I, I'm not with it at all. I'm not with it. Like I'm I'm with change. Uh, a lot of people talk about how the Premier League changed, but the Premier League changed. They still kind of created a structure where everyone kind of wins. They wasn't just thinking like, like the Premier League won, a group of teams won, not just these few at the top. Um, and I know like it's it's just getting smaller and smaller. So now it's a, a small elite of European teams. I don't know. I think that it could decimate so many systems. The Italian league. Uh, to be fair, okay, the Italian league. And to be fair. A good, like I've just talked myself into it, but a good rationale for it is I think currently the only league that is properly kind of maybe the German league, but the Premier League seems to be the only kind of big league that is very competitive and it just seems to go be going from strength to strength. Whereas the German league, Bayern Munich are dominating it, the French league, PSG are dominating. It's too easy for them. I can see the case. It's interesting because they don't want to join this league. Surely this league is no, more competitive for them. No, no but the, the Germans, as uh, Dan said, uh, German Dan said, they, they take into consideration what the people think. They wouldn't do oh, something. Okay, this is just... This is yeah, just it's because it's it's yeah. they can't. Yeah, they can't. They have the 50 plus 1 rule. They can't make yeah. a lot okay. of the decisions without the fans' approval. So. Okay, interesting. Yeah, interesting. But basically, don't get me wrong, I think, I think Bayern Munich is going to do this, and Dortmund as well, but they're not going to do it until... Was like good enough shape for them to join. I mean, it could be on a board pushing it. It's just, it's just, it's just um, um, marketing, um, like what you call makeup. They're not mm -hmm. doing this now. They can't be part of the rollout yeah, because of right. you know the phase positioning. Two. But they will two. be part of this. I'm, I'm really sure they'll be part of it. <laughs> Phase two, okay. Come with a scrum, with a scrum terminology, Dan. That then is reason the right terminology. Yeah. But yeah, no, yeah, I passed the rollout, you know. Yeah, yeah, I hear where you're coming from, Dan. But yeah, I, I, I can't wait to see it personally speaking. I, I think it'll be a great spectacle. So yeah, um, it'll be in oh, what will be interesting is what it does to the rest of their games. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to see it. Yeah, so, to be fair, like you're saying, Man United is going on now. I'm talking to you guys, I'm not watching the game, and like a hundred percent. If it was Man United versus PSG, I'm watching the game. But Think of all the hypothetical conversations we have about this player, that player, getting to see these guys play week in, week out against each other, against the best players. That's surely got to be got to be worth the watch, man. But it doesn't have to be that way. Like I, I'm fine with like change. I just don't agree with this way. We can create a, a European Super League, but the open. I like open competition. I like newness. Uh, do you know what I'm saying? Like, really and truly, think about it like this. I'm someone that fought on Touchdown Cracker. We don't just have the same class. Let's get new blood in. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I like the open system um, because it does create a thing where someone can come up. Like, a Manchester City are locked in now because they're a big club, but don't forget where they were 10 years ago or, like, maybe 15, 20 years ago. Or I like that P PSG, like, can just come out of nowhere. I don't necessarily think, let's create, let's get 20 teams 20 names, and those names are the same names. Do you know what I'm saying? Because different cities, there's so many cities. Why just choose 20 cities? I don't know. I don't like it. I'm, I'm not for it, man. Yeah, fair yeah. enough. I'm, I'm not for it. Buzzy, I want to hear you because it's for your people. You guys, your, your Trojan horse, all of these guys, the Glazers came in, the Liverpool guys came in, buck on the board of Chelsea. And the Americans are just like trying to change it to the American um, system of sports. So yeah, get your ass in here and explain yourself, man. <laughs> On behalf of your people, then I even want to sell Pulisic, man. That's how pissed off I am. And then the team that win, and what the team that wins it are, are the world champions, yeah, oh, like the team of basketball. Yeah, no, 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 I agree with that. Rick, what, Rick, you can come on and speak if you want, but um, 
what, what I would say is that um, the current Champions League format, it doesn't determine, I said this earlier as well, current Champions League format doesn't determine who the best team in Europe are. Chelsea are in the final four. We can win it. And yes, under Tuchel, we're a lot better. But um, tournament football doesn't tell you who the best is. Like, Agreed. just the way it happens. Like, four of the best teams can be on one side of the tournament. And then the other side of the tournament can have, like, wasters. And then the waster yep. gets to the final. And then if they have a good day, then they win the tournament. Tournament football doesn't do that. Where, and, and that's why we, we haven't had the answer, who is the best team in Europe for the last <laughs> whatever years. We haven't had the answer. We've just had who won the Champions League. If we yeah. do have a European Super League, then we will have closer to an answer of who the best team in Europe is. But like I said earlier, if Arsenal get into this, and let's say that Arsenal do remain in the Premier League, and then Leicester are like 20 points ahead of Arsenal in the Premier League, yet Arsenal, for some reason, are in this European Super League and Leicester are not. So, yeah, I don't, I don't think um, it's perfect, but definitely if they do bring a European Super League in, it's a better fitness test to who is the best team in Europe, at least. That's one plus point for it. But yeah, agreed. And, agreed. Another thing I said was that another thing I said was that Arsenal, like I'm sure a lot of Arsenal fans are happy they're included. But it's just like <laughs> they'll become the whipping boys of they'll probably become the whipping boys. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they'll probably become the whipping boys. Like a lot of fans, you talk to a lot of fans that get promoted and there was like it was it was it was better in the championship. Like we just got promoted to get beat every single week. And mm. Arsenal fan TV will get a whole new rung of subscribers. <laughs> what, 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 what? Um, yeah, now nah, you make you make good points. But I, if if it does happen, um, I don't know what, what like the percentages of it ha- actually happening at this point are with that strong statement that bad bread out. I can't wait to be honest. Can't wait. Could be. No, I think that that, <laughs> that statement for me is just they they knew that the 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 plans were gonna be. Least or some of, some of it was going to be leaked there, and they mm. needed a stronger response. I'm not the one thing that is strong about the statement is that the that they have the governing body of the domestic leaks kind of being there with them. But I think that could that could that can always change. I think I, I do think you're for on the ropes. You think they're I on think the ropes? Yeah. yeah. I, think, I think you're for on the ropes because mm. the big the big teams don't need you for. They might want to stay in their domestic leaks, but they really don't need you for. If they already have a union. To do this league, but Trump is the like... vice president of the Super League. Fucking hell! Yeah, let me let me ask you this question. Number one, I don't even like the people that are involved. Do you know when sometimes the people that are involved tell you, "I don't like this idea." I don't like. It's a bunch people. bunch of super villains. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Do you know what I'm saying? Um, but also, what was I going to ask again? Rick, Rick, you're American. You can speak for your people. In, in, in that time, can I ask a quick question? Yeah. So. Is this a replacement <laughs> Champions League, right? Rather than the well, rather than leagues. I'm sure that like the the teams that are going to play this European Super League, they're not going to be in a Champions League number. Mm. And the way that the the governing bodies are saying it is that to be fair, if you're part of that league, you're not going to be part of anything else. What's the statement that Bad read out? I didn't hear it. Oh, um, it's a long from, statement from, from Europa. Oh, is this a long it. statement? It's is a long statement. UEFA. We've already read it out like two or three times on here, but I'll send it to you. Help. You should have been on earlier, yeah? Or, Say or less. Re- rewind the YouTube to 38 minutes. Before you <laughs> can you just yeah. send, me, send me the statement, please, brother? I can read, yeah? Yeah, run it back. Run it back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, yeah, send in that statement. You can see the bear group chat talking about the, the game's gone. Oh, that was, I was like, fam, if, if it's replacing the Champions League and, and if, if it was qualification based, I, I don't see what's wrong that, with well, it. Well, that's the issue. It's, it's, it's not replacing the Champions League um, and it's so not it's just, qualification so it's league football. based. Huh? It looks like they've selected the teams already. So, so it's yeah, league selected, selected, they've selected. My understanding is that in its final form, there's going to be like 15 permanent teams with the idea that... Oh, like, they're they're saying they're announcing this tomorrow. A night, yeah, a night it's happening. It's happening. Yeah, I announced it this evening. So wait, it's happening. So it's official. This is on. The well, no, way. it's it's gonna happen. Obviously, the fight has started. That's what's happening. <laughs> the the fight is ensuing. 
Um, what a year, the man. Is, yeah, yeah, exactly. Exactly. What a year, dude. The thing is, if this league happened, yeah, and then the UEFA and stuff saying, look, we're going to keep the Champions League with all the remaining teams, you know how dead those lit that Champions League? Yeah, you can't call it the Champions League anymore. You've got to call it the league. Like, what the hell was that going to be called? Exactly. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah it's be Facts. You, Facts. You, you, right, you yeah, listen. You, need, you need, need these like, teams. Take away the top six teams and de- take away these teams from their leagues. What you got yeah, left, yeah. man? P- it's it's P- PSG man. versus Bayern every final. <laughs> <laughs> you, can't even, you can't use that song anymore. You better use the Europa song. That's like, yo, me. you're the you're the Wednesday night neighbor and shit like that. <laughs> that, that. That song is like an iPhone alarm, man. You're, you're the Wednesday night Ronald You're the Wednesday night Ronald Yeah. The the real league's happening on the Saturday night. Yeah, um it's crazy. These lot are crazy, man. I hear them. Obviously, they, it's their job to secure the best interests of their club. They don't care about the state of the game. They um, have to. They, they should, though. Like, the they should, but they don't, innit? No, but the sentiment the thing, stuff, right? them are not here for that. I They're here that. for... Yeah, I, hear I hear that. I hear that. But what Let I'm me saying, find the best format to make the most I, revenue. I, I get it. Mm-hmm. No, we're fans, so what we want is the best... Pro- like, we want the best football product. They've got their own agendas. We've got our agenda. Mm. Right? And mm-hmm. this issue is... Their agenda doesn't necessarily make the best football product. So I don't care what they want. I'm just saying what I want, right? And the, the thing is, if they do it... So what are we saying with transfers then? Uh, like, boxing, I see boxing, I can't keep up. There's so many different federations. There's the this, there's the that, there's the this. Like, if they create their own thing, does that mean a player has to declare for one organisation? Is it WCW, WWE thing? Do you know what I'm saying? Mm, interesting. What, what if, but what if they just come in? But if they surely if they just come in under FIFA, then it's fine. No, FIFA are not with this either. FIFA okay. Are international football got international. banned. International. Wallahi, brother, they're playing it. So what? FIFA saying Wallahi, brother, they're playing against us. Yeah. 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 yeah that's what I'm saying. So like, this is like a, like a new thing, yeah. So this Who's going to be the president of it? Jeff Bezos. Let's go, man. Well, yeah, they're, they're <laughs> funding, man. Let's like fucking go. Like JP Morgan throwing them the bag. Like, yeah. yeah. JP Morgan, oh, Jeff Bezos, so... Mark Zuckerberg. Or you can, or you can see Amazon on Yo, Facebook you, sponsoring, as as, man. If touch I get the bag, well, I might switch sides. I might switch sides. If I get the bag. But Mariah, <laughs> Mariah so Yo, bro. now you've heard the new update, um, what it means as well, these players can't play international football. So literally, from these elite players, all you're getting is the European Super League. They, you're getting anything Love else. it. Love it. I can't but, stand international football. No, but no, you can't stand international football during the season. But what about the final kind of stages of a... What, the tournaments? Yeah, that's that's good. But if this is the, if this is the trade-off, it was a good run, I, man. I need to get Mario <laughs> to see my side of the picture. <laughs> hey, it's not <laughs> I'll be back. I'll be, I'm coming. I'm coming. Right as I have to But Mariah, you're open to be convinced, yeah? You're, just just tell me that. You're open to Yeah, I'm open to being convinced. All right, cool. I'll Fucking stick. Florentino <laughs> Perez, man. I knew it was it's, him. He's been trying to get this thing in since 2000. He's been trying to get this shit in since the year 2000. Cool, do you know what the funny thing is? Perez... He actually extended his um his um his um time at Madrid just the other day. Yeah, yeah. and that's this is in the works. And the <laughs> poor, in the, the poor became back in Barcelona. Do you know what I'm saying? I don't yeah. know. I feel like everyone knew this was coming. Like, do you know what yeah. those things like when, when? Do you know like before Brexit? Barcelona like, need this badly. Do you know what we yeah. should do? The rankings of the, the how much debt these teams are in. Um, this is because that... <laughs> Barcelona are right at the top, and I think Real Madrid are second. <laughs> yeah. What I'll tell you. <laughs> What I asked earlier is who would be the winners and who would be the losers. Like, for the clubs that are in it, like, a lot of people will say Arsenal are going to be winners because they're going to get more money, etc. in it. But then I was saying, actually, you'd probably be losers because you'll be the whip and boys. Like, you might get... Like, do you know what I'm saying? That in, in the American franchises... Yeah, it the, it's not going to be the, fun. It's not fun. You yeah. Know what I'm saying? So, like... Watching your team lose week in, week out is not fun still. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Well, if Arsenal right. can start giving people money, I think we can attract a lot of players. Yeah, yeah, but the thing is, the better, better teams than you could also have this That's money now. So, how, yeah. how, how stacked can you be? Like saying, you know, all you're, these you're, teams you're, are already you're paying 50 for Xhaka instead of 30, you know? Nah, but you got. <laughs> What you gotta understand is what, what, what you gotta understand yeah, go is on. it kills the smaller teams. Like Real Madrid are gonna be stacked, yeah, sure. Barcelona are gonna be stacked. But a Grealish, yeah, yeah. Grealish at Aston Villa, all of a sudden Arsenal can buy him. You know? Yeah, but he probably wouldn't end up at, he probably wouldn't end up at Arsenal though. Maybe yeah, not, he, but 
these players that all of a sudden they, they'll all leave. You just be paying 50 million, million for Ross Barkley. You're paying 50 million for Ross Barkley. Yeah, don't bring Barkley into it, man. I'm really yeah. tired. Let's go, cool. Tiger. Yeah. Or, 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 or 50 million for Pulisic. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh my days. Did you see what I'm just saying? You already did that. You already did that. Did you see what man just said? What he said? He's like, if, Russell, if, if Americans have things their way, there will be no draws. Games will be going into overtime, and if you have it, you'll be having buzzer beats. <laughs> yeah, I mean, go, so I imagine mean, this, guys. Imagine this is a spectacle, yeah? No draws. Game goes into extra time. Golden goal wins. Come on. Who, who I can't loses? Lie, be, who loses? Every kind of wave. Who loses? Wave. <laughs> that would, that would slap, man. Who loses? No, no, nah, nah, think about the bows, though. Every game, there's going to be a bow. Come on, there has to be a bow. And then if, and you get 20 game. minutes extra time, and if you don't score uh, the golden goal, penalty shootout. Come on, man. Who's got the bottle? Who hasn't? Come yeah, on, man. Mariah watches too much American This is pure entertainment. He consumes too much American football. Dan, Dan, Dan you've been, you've been trying to, trying to sell Mariah, but it looks like, it looks like he's, he's no, going to be more he now. Has, he has he hasn't. He hasn't. Well, I can't lie. No draws would be kind of good, though. Arsenal might end up with just L's, but I hear these really. Pure entertainment, <laughs> man. That's a pure L's. There's, there's no, there's no, there's no draw com- column. Wins and losses. That is it. Wins and losses, man. Like, man. I don't want to hear nothing. Like and it not manages, not and also what it does, it, it seems can't play for a draw. It encourages teams mm, to go for right. a win. You're spitting right now. You're spitting it encourages right. managers to go for it because you can't just get one point I, and then just, you know. Oscar, Oscar, I can't believe what you said. But uh, I don't mind taking away the draws. I don't mind, but that's not the conversation we're having. What we're talking about is this whole idea of decimating all other Dan, Dan the, the conversation's moved. International, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. That's not the conversation we're having. <laughs> we're, we're, we're moved. No, no, we're, we're bringing it back. We're, we're bringing it back. We're, go on, go on. We're decimating all other types of football. International football. Uh, obviously, like, club football, like Champions League. Then you've got your domestic league. There's so many different layers currently, and you're just happy with this one league where it's one every is it one every two weeks we're saying one game every single two weeks yeah oh that's yeah. dead yeah i feel it's versus Ansu fatty every weekend come on man let's is get it, a crack yeah let's it, get it, it let's get it let's get it let's get it whichever way bro Ansu fatty versus yeah i feel it's every other weekend messi versus ronaldo twice a season okay scary let's get it let's get it going let's get man it done, really? oh you think Bob, oh you think Bob was the best midfielder in the world oh let's see what happens when he has to play modric cruz Come on, man, let's do it. Thiago, hey, do, 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 do you know that was one thing I was saying? Like, Chelsea um, reached the semi finals of the Champions League seven times, yeah, but the first time they've ever met, they're ever meeting Real Madrid. The format is wrong. Mm-hmm. The format is crap. The Champions I, League yeah, format I is crap. I get that format is wrong. I get, I, yeah, I get Think, I, think I how deep you've gone in this competition so many times, and you've, this is the first time you're meeting Real Madrid. The format is wrong. Well, no, yeah, no, well, yeah, in the Champions League. Yeah, yeah but... that's what I mean. In the Champions I, League. I, I get that. Reform, yeah, reform, reform of the Champions Trickle League. Trickle down right? economics tells me we will get a drink out of this, boys. That's the thing. The tri- there's too much... Yeah, there'll be too much money swimming in this for us to not get. Yeah. No, got... no, hey, no, hey, no, hey, no, hey, no, hey, Dan, 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 no, Dan, no, Dan. No, Dan. No, Pack it in, man. <laughs> <laughs> Right, I'm sorry, that's not gonna. Mario thought that was gonna convince. Me. <laughs> <laughs> scored, he he should. Scored. Two one, yeah. Okay. okay. Two, one, what minute is that? Yeah, Dan. Remember when you were? T- uh, oh, he just scored one goal. And I said, listen, he just scored two goals, two and two. Now he's what? Four and three. I'm on the. Look, yeah. I'm a Greenwood fan. If he scores, yeah, you cool. should have supported me that time, though. I remember. No, that I time. wasn't against. Yeah, I wasn't against Greenwood. I was against you. You have to understand. The- <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's fair enough, man. It's, 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 it's been seven years of this, so I understand. But yeah, back back to this talk. So, um, yeah, I come on, man. The best players week in, week out. I think that would be so you good, keep man. keep saying week in, week out, but what I'm saying is... It okay, works. Fortnite in, Fortnite out, whatever I you want like, to do. That's my issue with it. That's my issue. I like variety. Do you know what I'm saying? Nah, I don't want to watch Chris Wood. I don't want to watch... I don't want to watch Che Adams. I don't want to watch Che Adams. I don't want to watch Danny Ings. I don't have to watch him. But they are... every week, every week, I want to be able to see the best against the best, man. Let's do it. Oh, Greenwood, love it. Left foot. Ah. Let's go. There was a big deflection. Who's the goalkeeper? Who's alive? What's his name? 
I said, I've never seen him in my life, you know. Okay, what are you the dick? Look what I'm watching. Look what I'm watching. Every single player playing. Explain yourselves. Yeah. Man said they've got Percy Jackson in goal. What the hell is this? One second. Do you know like when Howard comes on Discord and asks, who's this? Yeah. That's what Babs is doing when he's seeing these goalkeepers. Like, you shouldn't be doing that. There are Premier League players now. If you see them on the street, you wouldn't know they're Premier League players. That wouldn't happen in the Super League, mate. That would not happen. That wouldn't, bro. Your, back, your backup keeper is a starter in whatever's left of the Premier League. Come on, man. None of these no- nobody's popping up on your screen, mate. Come on, man. Let's get it, man. Talking about yeah. I've, I've only watched Barcelona. Bigger, bigger pictures. Bigger Bear pictures. No. Bigger goals. Yeah, go on. Barcelona got bare no the other day. I was like, who are half of these dogs? Exactly. Can't like to get rid of them boys. Some wavy youth players or something. Let, let, let that money c- come through, man. That, that team will be kitted out, bro. Trust me. <laughs> oh, okay, Dan, boy. Jem Dan. Jem and Dan. Jem and Dan. Jem and Dan. Let me ask you this question. Obviously, Arsenal's on the list. This is hypothetical, but if Arsenal wasn't there, would you still be for it? Yeah. Don't lie, you should be like, honestly, ah, still I, I, I will it. still be for it. So, so Arsenal are outside the club, <coughs> and you'll be happy. Yeah, we'll, have, we'll have to qualify then, but uh, it is what it is. Oh, but at this point, the qualification, like, we, we, we get out. No, 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 the, the, the point is, I think, what they're saying, there's five qualifying spots, isn't it? No, don't forget, there's, there's no way their two are going to integrate, because this European Super League, they're saying, once you do that, you can't be involved in the normal system. That's what I'm saying. Everything else is decimated. So if Arsenal are out of the club, you're out of the club permanently. Yeah, then we'll, we'll just have to focus on the, on the league, mate. But we are in it, so it's good. All right, we focus on the Super League, man. <laughs> Re- man, I've got a rest player for the Super League. Like, forget I, that. It's come I, out of your competition, I, I, I hear man. what Dan is saying, though. I hear what he's saying. It's but not without league, merit. It's not without merit. The, 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 the 10 most valuable teams or clubs in, the, in world football are, are going to most likely be in that league. Yeah, so, you know the rest yeah. of you know Southampton versus Everton I mean, every week. Good and, luck. And what man. I'm just asking you, Dan, and what I'm asking you, like, I know you are in the list, but yeah, if Arsenal wasn't, then how would you feel about it? You'd be vexed. Let's be honest. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be disappointed. Well, depending on who you support. <laughs> Genuine question, though: Why can't a Super League have ration and then like? Because that. Yeah. Because, because, a, because the point. These, are, these are the biggest, most marketable clubs yeah, in the this, world. This is, they're going to get so much. They'll come back the no, next year then. No, no that's shit. Like, no. You so you got, go on, go on, Jim. Yes. What you got to understand, this is a broadcast product. You need to have all the big um, the big entities that bring viewership in. If you lose in some of these, you lose in value. It's like when big teams in the Premier League get relegated. Right. You're losing this viewership because they're going to another league. Right. You need to consolidate the viewership. And you need to get the best possible what, broadcast product. So just quickly, what what German ads was spot on in terms of these aren't happy that they're not they have to qualify for the Champions League. And Man United are saying no, we should be in the Champions League. Manchester United, no, it's that they're not in the Champions League. They can't get the best player, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, even though they've got the resources to. Mm-hmm. And so this is part of the reasons why I feel like I think German Dan explained it well. Where they're saying no, actually, we'll create our own league where Man United are always in the game. That's why it goes against that because that's more of the same. They're saying no, we want to always play the top clubs, and we've got the money to put the best players together, and we want to create a competition where it's just for the best of the best. And I understand that. I understand. Mm, but I'm, that's what the I'm is, <clears throat> This is a line in the sand from what we already have to something completely different. And what we're having in this discussion is. Do we think it's a good or not? I'm not saying there's there's obviously yeah. positives and negatives, um, negatives of both. But I'm just saying like, like, even if we were to do this, I think rather than having just this quick jump to it, I think we need to f- phase it out because what happens if we do it and it's horribly wrong? Um, it's going to be difficult to go Bam. back. Or maybe it's not. Bam. I don't know. Yeah. Bam. Um, I'm really sorry to interrupt you. But <clears throat> what ads is just put in, in the chat right now? It's one of the funniest jokes I've seen this year. <laughs> the first movie what that you say? was the sound. Who was on crack? Right now. Right now. 
we got to pin that to the thread, man. Somehow, we'll hey. that. every time I log into this chat, I need to see that again. That's hilarious. Oh, my God. <laughs> The only yeah. thing that could have been funny is if you, if you attached the video. <laughs> I, would have, I, would have, I would have lost my head. Oh, oh my, oh, my shit. God. Oh, oh, okay, oh, you don't need to tell me my Tom and Elmo's school. Keeping that quiet, yeah? Okay. Don't ever hop on Morgan Live and say If we said shit. that, then yeah. Seb would have been here out of nowhere. Mm. Interesting, man. Hey, this time. Time's- Gonna be apparently nine thirty tonight. Yeah, that's I heard it's tonight. Yeah, it's yeah, I put Rick Rashford in that group as well today. I think he's he was pretty good. Uh, obviously he didn't score. <laughs> I am not Stephen. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> hey, man. Is this, is, this is a mad thing. This is really a mad thing. Super League, baby. Do not chat to me with not in the Super League, honestly, man. Uh, Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. Oh, why Super League Bruno coming to TV screens near you, man? <laughs> I think every kit will be gold. Stitching, stitching done with twenty-four karat gold. Let's go, Spurs. You're not lucky, you know. You know. Yep. Not great. Too. Be grateful, man. Yeah, that's, very. That's, Premier that's, that's Premier League. That's Premier League tax. That's Pete Kane. Now they'll keep. Now they'll. Yeah. Yes, bro. Now they'll keep Kane. A million pounds. Yeah, keep. man. Why not? <laughs> yes. Yeah, Spurs have an American owner too. That's actually United. Uh, Lewis. scored a really nice goal. Cavani. Yeah, he was. It's a good goal. Yeah, great goal. He's good. Cavani. Really good goal. Very good goal. What's a three one? Goals now from all comes. Yeah. Three yeah. one. Shut up, man. Guys are coming on here bowing. Super League. Three one. Manchester United playing the Super League and Champions League next season. Don't ask me any questions. Yeah. <laughs> Hold it forward. I, 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 I direct you to, I direct you to my press officer. I direct you <laughs> to my press officer. <laughs> going forward. Come on. Super League chat only. You know yeah. The I'm not the hearing the it. Coming, boy. I'm not hearing it from none of you boys, man. Guys are drawing 2 2 together and talk to me about Super League, man. Yeah. <laughs> Sam tried perfect timing. You think I forgot that time, yeah? Oh, didn't you do it? The timing news, because they just made it 1 1. They did as well. Yeah, United 2 2 or whatever. We drew 3 3. We drew 3 3. No, we drew 3 3, exactly. Get your facts right. Okay. Taking this Cavani goal, though. Nah, it's a good goal. Very it's a good nice goal. Work. Good oh, is that a Donny assist? Yeah. Is that a Donny assist? Is that a Donny assist? Yeah. Come on. Al Matador. Come on, man. Yeah, right. Man. This, this is a fun one. Not fun. Super League now. Free. Come on, man. What a day. Thank you, boys. Mm-hmm. Woo. Mm-hmm. Woo. What, what, what is this team? Mm. I don't mm. want. I don't want to watch this in a week. Oh, man, you get this shit off my. No, Burnley. Exactly. Watching Burnley. You're in the Super League. You're not worried about this, bro. This would have been so, Barcelona. Yeah, it's very bummy, man. Yep. Okay, that's first phase. Yep, second phase. Love it. <laughs> nice goal, boys. Cavani, oh, Greenwood, Greenwood, God, Bruno, Bruno to Van der Beek, Van der Beek, Cavani, love it, and it, fucking upset, oh my God, that's a few, yeah, yeah. so another league goal for Cavani, yeah, is it just a little extra sounds again, that's it, FA Cup, see, hey, FA Cup, reaching for that, who don't watch that? You clean, exactly. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Be damned the hockage. <laughs> okay. I'm not even against Oh, you. gosh. Really. Oh, you're off, Dan. 
I think I think I would prefer what people were saying as like a placement for the Champions League, uh, like a Champions League kind of reformatting where the big teams do kind of get in and they play each other more regularly, maybe in like a league-based system, but then we still get the Premier League. I think I'd prefer that than to kind of just take away from, like take all the big clubs away from the other leagues. That'll make everything a bit, a bit shit. So you're not for it? <laughs> no, but, no, 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 I'm really for the oh, Fucking hell. hell. Yeah, very... <laughs> hey, so, let me say that much. Nick Paul ain't making it to the Super League, man. Yeah, I'll take you that for free, mate. Yeah, I mean, maybe not. Hey. But, no, no. Like, hate and all of that. No wonder you're for it. You hate. I them. want to be the big club play more. Like that yeah, is what sure. I want. No it's not. Yeah, that's what that's what I like as well. But that's not the, what the European Super League will be. The oh, European Super League is. I literally, like I literally, like literally like do that. Yeah. No, I no. Like I'm saying and that. then read up. Say that again. One more time. They keep talking over you. No, I'm saying European Super League. Talking about a complete separation. There's no. Promotion, separation you know, of power. In, it's, in, in phase three, there will be there will be promote there will be teams participating. So just a couple phases, couple more iterations. Who's <laughs> got this roll up now? Is it? Are you making it up in the flag? No, that's what I, that's what I, I, I saw an article. That's what it said in it that there will be fifteen permanent teams. Of yeah. Uh, yeah, I read an article in the uh, flag yeah. and it said. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Super League. We- both sides. I, I don't see great how are they going to get the relegation of our They are going to bend because these what happens to the five teams? What do you say? Like the teams that get into the super, they just in it for one year and they get out. new five teams. Hey, that's iteration four, so I'm not sure, mate. Phase four, you're asking about. I'm imagining what the bottom two get really back into their league. I, I don't know, man. It's just a work in progress, man. Mm. Yeah. Imagine weekly games the Wonder Metropolitan, um, Real Madrid Stadium, the New Camp, Old Trafford, Highbury, um, Highbury, sorry, yeah. Emirates. Uh, come on, yeah. man. This is football, football man. Yeah. Yes, you can. Okay. People asking me about can he do it a stop way, bro. Can he do it? Can he do it? Do it? <laughs> a cold Tuesday night at the Emirates. A cold, can you do a cold Tuesday night? I'm pretty sure he's already done that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that's the, that's what the Super League chat will be. Can he do it a cold Tuesday night? At the Emirates, let's find out, man. Don't be quality, boys. Oh, we also get rolled over, man. Oh, with dust, or get rolled over. But there's, there's have you seen the hey, pitch? Mar- for... Mar- Mar- is finishing me, man. Have you seen the pitch for the new version of Champions League? What's that? No, what's this? Um, more so teams, no? Yeah, so the same. Look what they're doing. Look at what they're doing. Look how they look at the Champions League, man. <laughs> Literally, they're gonna be. Yeah, we've got teams, teams in it. Like, they want Everton. They want Everton in a new... Uh, what's this? <laughs> what's this? <laughs> Top 18 in the league to qualify for the champion. Come on, man. What, what is that? They would... What is that, man? Look how they massacred, how they massacred my... That's just you're your playing even shitter teams. You're playing like Sassuolo or something. I like it. Who? 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 Really? Come on, man. Let's go. Man, Super League. Benzema versus Van Dijk. I'm not trying to hear none of this Benzema versus that guy. Real Sociedad, that guy who plays for Granada. Benzema is the best striker in the world. Who's Let's going the most same, in that league? Yeah, same, league. same league, Ooh. play the same team. Who's scoring the most goals? No, no, Bundesliga attacks all goals. No, no, no. Yeah, now you know why I need that league. No, no, nice. No, <laughs> No more Bundesliga tax. We're not hearing that, man. Oh, he's scoring, if he's going 25 in the sub league, uh, it's 44. Do you know what's crazy about this? 
Oh, are you crazy about this, sir? There will have to be a prem tax then, because the, yeah, the best is yeah. Super League. 25, <laughs> 25 in the Super League, it's going 40 in the prem. Wait. <laughs> oh, what if they keep the Champions League? Oh, 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 what are you talking about? You want to the best teams we get weekend after weekend. Yeah, 20, 30, 40 quid, man. They've got to get money back, man. Trust. How would they do it for like the spectator though? Like the fans, like with the stadiums and stuff. And the oh, Discord what? lives as well. The Discord, like, the Discord lives would be unaffected. Oh, everybody would be okay. everybody would be everybody would be on Discord live. Guys are Guys, look, we got Toad, who's a stadium enthusiast. He'd be loving it, going to these stadiums week in, week out. <laughs> I guess they do hey. like basketball, don't they? Price do of the brick going up for real. Price of the Discord live going up. Price of the Discord live going up. All right, yo, we might not have to meet. Let me hop to the San Siro real quick, boys. United away at AC. United away at AC, man. Come on. All you man watch us on YouTube. Oh, okay. All you man watch us on, you, on YouTube from Europa uh, Super League. Best know that premium YouTube members only. There's <laughs> 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 no standard users. Hey. <laughs> yeah, if, if, if they're glowing up, we're glowing up. A hundred percent. Hey, what? Yeah, Amazon will bag it. Are you nuts? Amazon oh will bag it. Oh my god. Hey, Amazon get it. I can't lie. I'm, I'm, get, I'm, getting, I'm getting ready. Amazon I can't will right. bag that. Bezos will personally. Yeah, Amazon have probably already got that. Will yeah. personally fund that. Yeah. BT, 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 Sky, all of that in the month. They can't survive without four. They can't compete, man. They can't. You know what's about Sky will be doing 100%. Super Sunday. Fam, you man will see Elon Musk all around the, the stadiums ground and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All these will be all the Elon Musk will buy a club. Hundred percent. Gonna need to up the stream game. Stream game. Yeah. VAR brought to you by Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need that Amazon sponsorship on the shirt. That Amazon sponsorship on the shorts. Come on, man. Facebook on the socks. That's it. Bro. We're selling everything, man. Hey, just head that. that uh, say, Max, where is? Look, you see, you see the Amazon headband. <laughs> 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 Oi, that race, that race in France is looking nuts, man. Yeah, even yeah. even Spain. Huh? Um, I mean, team to get into the Super League. Yeah, I've got a big game. I haven't got a lot of players available, man. Mm-hmm. This is what Real. Okay. Oh. okay. okay. Yeah. Again, they're, 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 um, they're away at Hatafe. They've got like four first teamers fit. Wow. Jeez. Sacrifice everything to be Liverpool. What did it cost you? I need that, everything. man. I need that. I also finished part of the Super League and Premier League fan tried banter me. Now I'm good where I am. <laughs> 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 I'm not, hey, I, we can't see them, man, German Dan. Hey. At all, bro. You know, you man, man, me, shit. I don't want to hear it, man. Don't you, want you, 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 you are playing domestic leagues. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> No, we haven't actually Harold as a Liverpool fan. How do you feel? That is great. I'm I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, <laughs> do you know who I want to hear? Do you know who I want to hear from? Yes. I want to hear from a fan. I don't know. No, I want to hear from a fan of a team that's not in there. Get more who supports the team? Get Moises in there. Get Moises. What are you saying, man? Man said he's going back to Arsenal fan. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle, 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 what are you talking about? <laughs> can you can imagine uh, Arsenal tanking for lottery picks. Oh my goodness. Tank for Zion. <laughs> <laughs> hey. oh, oh my God. Listen, no, man. What the fuck do we even. Bro, if there's one team, I, I, no, no, they have to be there, man. Forget it. Ignore me, man. What are you going to say? Man City, but they have to be there, man. Shrews to say they, they denied it. They didn't it, sign but... it though, did they? Apparently they were one of the ones that disagreed. Apparently, with apparently, it. They, apparently they actually did though. Oh. Fam, yeah. the, I can't lie to you. If it goes ahead, the Premier League need Man City in the Super League. Imagine Man City and the rest in the Premier League. Fam, that's 152 <laughs> points. 
152 Boy. points. Boy. It would be a mess. If, if City just stay in the Premier League, they're, they're winning it every year, man. That's basically... Said, oh, United, yeah? Right we'll, 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 don't worry, we'll, we'll overtake you in, in no time. We'll, t- we'll take you in no time. <laughs> the thing is, City will. will love it, though, because they hate the Champions League anyway, don't they? Their fans are so... Do they? Their fans have been boycotting it for a minute. No, 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 no. They haven't been boycotting it, bro. <laughs> they don't have like... fans. They're be, they've been getting dunked on. That's, that's what's been happening. <laughs> that's the, that's that's what they're calling going out in the Well, they don't have fans yeah. anyway, but no, I'm pretty sure there was an issue with them in uh, something to do with the Champions League, right? But obviously no, they don't have that. Imagine boycotting the Champions League. Are you okay? Nah, <laughs> there was... Well, he, he was boycotting it, sorry? No, I'm pretty sure Man, U, Man City fans, there was some issue with them in Europe. Fucking... I don't know. I'll try and pull it up. I wonder if they're support, in support of it now. Look at these men in the Sky Sports studio looking like someone came and, and, and stole their bread. Michael Richards and Roy Keane out here looking so upset. Uh-uh. By the Super League? Yeah. Like, bro, I don't understand it, man. It's because it's their, their bosses don't want it, in it? So you, you can't you can't, you can't can't support that. Damn, what? <laughs> I know, I know. If, 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 imagine your boss saying, hey, look, <laughs> you, you better be careful, boy. <laughs> 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 listen, 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 listen. Be careful what you say. Them man are for their jobs. Boy, I was going to say, bro. Yeah, because when it's the best of the best, it's not just the best of the best players. It's best the, of the best commentators, commentators, analysts. Yeah. Because yeah. so all, all them analysts gonna have to learn English, boy. All of you. <laughs> <laughs> you don't they're sending you, they're sending you on, on a two week intensive course. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> that is, that is you don't know you start learning. Luka Vucic right. is very keen. Yeah. The, the action is too fit. Man, that can't, that can't go. <laughs> we said you can't go global, yeah? Soon this is out of here. Michael, Michael Richard get the gig though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gilliam, you know what though? You know what? Gilliam, <laughs> come on, man. You know what? Michael and Kara and that He's really buff woman from Sky Sports. I've got her name. But wait, 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 what did you say, Harold? In, in, in he said, 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 said Gilliam. Harden? No, I wait, said, wait, what did you say? Michael Cara and that really buff woman from Sky Sports have their own gig at B and Sports. Yeah, this guy, I knew you said that. What's her name again? Are we not on YouTube? Does that matter? I mean, what? Is a man now not is a man now not allowed to Hey, hey, go, go, go ahead, man. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I don't understand. <laughs> What's her name again? Kate Abdo. Yeah, that's her name. Oh, 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 oh you, 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 you were lying. You were lying. Oh. Oh, that's her name, Kate Abdo. Yeah. Anyway, anyway, that man got a gig already on um on the CBS. Arabia Airlines. Oh yeah. 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 That, that. yeah, yeah, yeah. Got my, they got Arabia. my Nice. Oh my days. They got Michael Richards doing backflips and all sorts, man. No commentary, oh, just fine. Show us your athleticism, Micah. Yeah, that I've missed the commentary, boys. Come on, man. What they used to do with cartwheel in a suit. You know in a suit. A well fitting oh, suit. Cartwheels. cartwheels alone, I've been in a suit. Howard. Yeah. Howard, you see yeah. how close yeah. I've got one. Oh, Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, nah, let's, yeah, let's crack it. The pal is when uh, Balotelli got Time for Super League, league man. Against Porto. Super League. Super <laughs> League. Super <laughs> League. <laughs> 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 I know, man. All, all I need yeah, is, is the qualification thing. That's all I need, and, and I'm sold. I'm sold, man. I'm so I'm sold. I don't want us now. I don't want us ever getting relegated, brother. Every no, game. man. Come on, man. I, 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 come, I come last. I'm still there next year. I go again, man. Give us like a, a playoff, a playoffs. Give us a playoffs, even. I'd love that. Look, what I read was mm. when it's this final like version of it. Um, it's twenty teams, top eight going to the play, and going to a playoff format. Hold on, what? Hold on, what is Gary Neville saying? This guy is just trying. He's he's yeah, Gary Neville, he's frying us, bro. He's frying he's, us. What's he saying? He's basically saying Tottenham are in Champions League. What do they deserve to be there for? Arsenal couldn't even beat Fulham. It's an absolute <laughs> joke. <The Super laughs> <Cup is insane. laughs> He's frying us, brother. He's frying us. <laughs> hey, Gary Neville, you're right, and we still gonna collect that free thirty. <laughs> what was that? Is that, is that Neville or Carragher? Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 hey, they're no, cooking. No, they're no. cooking Elijah, boy. Why? Who posted here? He spoke about the Super League. He gave his thoughts, and he's all for it. And they're cooking him. <laughs> Let me see. Let me see.
I don't want to be on the side of Gary Neville. That's and, and that's he's going to join in. Yeah, I don't. I, I feel like <laughs> I'm agreeing with the wrong people. <laughs> the individuals on my list isn't where I'm at. I find it hilarious that people are on their high horse about European Super League. Yeah, no, mm-hmm. but no. He's wait, wait, right. Dan, Dan, Dan. Mm-hmm. Uh, wait, 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 Dan. I have a quick question. Yeah, go ahead. How dare you come on here and try to convince Morayo about being on board with with Super League not going ahead when a man in your own household is against you? Can you put up on your own home? Your own house is against you. They're playing the games, man. All the work that uh, you're currently trying to work for has been undone by a man in your own world. Go down to the side of the broadcast of it. <laughs> it's true. When I'm on the side of uh, Sam the Hokage, I'm, I'm, I'm on a switch. I'm on a switch. Never wants <laughs> Stephen A. Rock. Bob, I'm not even on that side. Hey. I'm saying, I'm saying. And you're on the side of Brexit England, they say. <laughs> Gary Neville's head is kettled. His face is fully red. <laughs> oh, he's All he's thinking evil. about is Swarford. All he's thinking about he's is so Swarford. Guy, guy <laughs> oh, we cannot... We, we cannot get to this Super League. It's all he's thinking about. Don't for one minute think that this guy gives a shit about the league, the good of the league, man. That is an evident, man. It's been this fucking cold out there, man. Uh, Elijah's getting cooked, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you, know that, you know that Drake meme? Oh, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I hate it had to be him, man. I hate it had to be man, him. Man. Oh, Let me join in. Man. I don't know what's going on. Oh my days! Is your IQ in the low forties? Yeah. It's oh my hurt, days! Man. Who uh, asked him that? Did somebody ask him that? Yeah, yeah. That yeah. <laughs> <laughs> up is not real, man. The players will have two teams. In three matches, we'll have three teams against each other instead of seven in the NBA. Best three teams to win goes through. The angle score will not matter. Oh well, shit! Again, Let's again. go. Let's go. This is the chat. The players will have teams play three matches against each other instead of seven in the NBA. <laughs> the first one to win two goes through. The aggregate score will not matter. Ads is killing me. Oh my days. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> of everyone who watched it one on one, the fans like, the match is at the death before it. You better score. I want fuck you out. <laughs> I'm just kidding it. <laughs> oh my days. And then Stephen A's just there, like, come on, come on, you want Marshall? <laughs> All the players they got, fuck it, yeah. Uh. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. Mariah, can you go check that chat, me? Well, hold on. Let's see. Sure. Look what you have to say. Did this cover? I still fly, fly, fly. Is that real? <laughs> M- Mariah has finished me, man. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe it. Oh, please. Gunner's gun gun red. Give it a break, man. Come on, bro. Join the movement. You know, in the Super League. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I, I can't lie. I can't lie. I, I get the whole relegation. I, I'd actually like relegation, man. I, I'd like hey, that. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, get, no, get rid of no, the bombs, no, no, no. man. Bad, 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 bad. Stop for a second. Who is outside of the league that you want to enter? Yeah, that's a, that's a good question, actually. It depends. To be honest with you, it depends. Uh, what are you going to say? I think you're going to say something similar. Yeah, it depends on who's in the league in the first place. Yeah, I agree. Okay, okay. Teams. There might be some teams outside that are better than the teams inside. Let's assume we have the top six we have in, in the Premier League. We've got in uh, La Liga, we've got Real, Barca, um, Atletico, and who, who would be the fourth? Maybe Sevilla? Probably Sevilla, yeah. Yeah, cool. I think, Harold, I think, I think the idea is if there is this league, then even if your bottom team is rubbish, then they're going to cherry pick, hopefully, exactly. the best players from outside. If, but you need to understand got... that it's they're the biggest market team. Like, there's a reason why they even though no, that's what I'm are... saying. I'm agreeing oh. with you. I'm what I'm agreeing with you. I'm saying that with this Super League um thing, even if you're bottom, then you could just go and buy the best teams from a Bayern Munich if they're not in it or a PSG if they're not in because you got just way more money than everybody else right, outside it. Right, but 
but I'm saying, assuming the best of the best is in there, mm-hmm. right? So that's what I'm saying. So assuming we have our top six from 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 PL, we maybe have the top two from from League R, we have the we have the top four from Serie A, top four from La Liga, etc., etc. Mm-hmm. Who uh, who else that's in, that's not part of it? Would you be like, ah, oh, I wish they were in it. I wish they had a chance to get in it. I don't care for Leicester like that at all. You, you, so, you don't. But then don't forget, PSG and Man City, like they're they're recent. Like even Chelsea to a degree, we're recent clubs. So there might be a club that can come out of obscurity and be mm-hmm. one of the clubs you want. Yeah, in there. yeah, it's, it's too late. You have to wait. You have to know, wait for that generation. Just... Yeah, wait. Yeah, <clears throat> she's done it pre super. She's done it pre super. You know what baby. I mean? <laughs> Do you not think that's very elitist? Yes! That's life! <laughs> that's yes. life! Where have you been? Yeah, it is very uh, elitist. I don't know, what man. Like, I like, like, I, like I said, morning. I like the idea for top clubs playing against each other more regularly, but I'm with Dan. Like, the closed-off system feels a bit just feels a bit iffy to me. Yeah, man. These, if, if they open the system, it, it stops being what, what they brought it in for. Exactly. That's what, yeah, it, it's different. Yeah, you either you're for the system or you're against it. Yeah. It's you see this Gary Neville thing. I need to see the Gary Neville shit. How, like, how have I've they genuinely like, decided who the six, say, the six English teams that decided to go in it? Is it based off revenue? Is that what it is? No, they just invited the names that they liked. Plus, it's like a friend's network. I'm sure that it's Americans as well, but... Arsenal, also it, the, it makes the sense. The big six. In England. It's the big yeah. six. Everybody knows who the big six are. You don't, I don't even have really? to ask you. Yeah. It's the big six. Yeah. But like, even this season, there's been arguments about the big six and do a club like Leicester, obviously the obvious one that keeps coming up. Do That's they? Banner. That's banter. We know who the big six are. Yeah, now, we do. Come on, Leicester, man. Leicester might be better than Arsenal now, but we know like, like <laughs> even though Leicester are better, if Arsenal and Leicester come into a club, like, look at the players that Arsenal are signing still. Like, Leicester aren't signing the players that um, Arsenal are signing. They're signing better yeah. ones. No, Gary as Neville's in... saying, oh, these clubs are bottle merchants, they won't do it. He don't know Florentino Perez, boy. <laughs> <laughs> For real. For real. For real. If, if he's not careful, For Perez will get him signed. Another point as well. Obviously, if the Super League... Um, if the Super League becomes Gargantua, a thing... Cool. Mm-hmm. Uh, and obviously, you say the Premier League and the, obviously all the other leagues, most of the money from them leagues goes towards the bigger clubs. So would then the clubs that are still in the Premier League but not in the Super League, would they potentially get more money? Wait, wait, because wait, 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 wait. No, no one's no one watching it. The money wait, goes wait, where wait. the eye goes. Yeah. yeah. The money goes where the eyes go. Yeah. I'm not calling the money, the money goes all the way down. Remember, in, in the Premier League, guys, it's these big teams that bring the revenue in. But there's a very like it's revenue sharing, isn't it? Like they they don't relative to the yeah. eyes that they bring to the league, they don't get that share of the money. So for them, it's like yeah. that doesn't work for us. Like people are paying billions for the Premier League not exactly. to watch Fulham, not to watch yeah. um, um Southampton, not to watch West Brom. It's because they want to see Chelsea, Man U, Man City, Arsenal, Liverpool, um Tottenham, I guess. Um, so yeah, from their perspective, it's not working. Yeah, from their perspective, uh... yeah, it, it's not working. So boy. I get where they're coming from, man. I get where they 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 got to look after their clubs, man. But you know, let's let's go. Let's get cracking, man. Yeah. Oh I man, it, it, you know what? It's somewhat goes against everything. It's somewhat yeah. goes against everything I, I, that I believe in. But I'm all yeah. for it. Then so what, have you changed? Have you changed your beliefs? No, I, just because a couple of quotes uh, man. That you know what? Do you know what? Actually, actually, actually <laughs> Mariah, 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 I can't lie. I actually got a new job. Life is different. <laughs> <laughs> Life is different. <laughs> hey, do you know what this I'm means? Brand... on the other side of the fence. He's I'm in a brand new tax bracket. I said, what's going on here? Yeah, he's very <laughs> tall. Do, well, do you no, know no, what no, this, no. this move shows me? Do you know what this facility shows me? That a lot of the things that people like to pretend they believe in, they don't really believe in. And I, I'm, yeah, I'm honest true. about this myself. It is true. That's, that's a, the main thing with socialism. Yeah. This is... Socialism. The champagne socialist, brother. Until it's time to you. Yeah. Three fifty million upon entry, bro. That's just entrance fee. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Find your pocket. Find your pocket. UEFA print a sixty thousand million euros <laughs> lawsuit against the participating. Well, club. those clubs can handle that, man. Oh, did, you see, did, you, did you see the lawyers, Man City, bro? <laughs> Yeah, hundred percent. Man City will pay it alone. City are in, in it because I think it's the six clubs, isn't it? Yeah, people are saying. Okay. People are saying Man City. Wait, you know or not? But why aren't they on that list? 
Yeah. Weird. I'm telling you, City's not in it. I heard that it was just top five of one of uh, five of the big six. Okay. And yeah, the, uh, I heard that as well. Who's you not source? I heard. No, nah, I saw. I gen- I did. I don't. I just saw this morning that five out of six of the big English clubs oh. have signed it. If it does happen, we need to do Stamford <laughs> Bridge up. I'm not coming around with, oh, Chelsea have the smallest stadium in the Super League. I'm not here for all of that. Oh, who cares, man? Will you, will you have the smallest stadium? Well, you won't for long. Have <laughs> <laughs> even got a rich laugh now? <laughs> <laughs> Super League. Super uh... League. Hey, come on, man. Let's get it. Is Eddie and Ketia? Why is he doing that? Arsenal win today? Yeah, he scored. No, they, they win, didn't yeah. win. He equalised. Oh, they, they drew, they drew. Yeah, they drew. European Football League got Arsenal in that. They've just drawn with Fulham. Yeah. This time they'll be drawing with Barca. Come on, man. Super League. Super League. Hey, come on, man. Get I'm here for it. Hey, I get man. to watch Arsenal and Spurs just get pumped every weekend. I'll be here for that. Super League, it's got 45. Hey, bro, I can't lie. We, we, we may just be a, a bit near that. I can't no, lie. We got... no. <laughs> no, we won't. No, we won't. No, we won't. No, we won't. Uh, do you know what? Uh, no, we got two. Uh, we got a... Babs, don't pussy. forget. Don't forget, everyone's got money in that league. Everyone will have money anyway. So money ne- necessarily won't be the difference. Yeah. It'll be your scouting system. It'll be your manager. I think that's what will be the difference. Hey. They're, breaking, they're breaking away from the Champions League, not from the domestic leagues. Yeah, but the domestic leagues are saying if you go to it, you're quite, you're not involved in the domestic league. Yeah, which is stupid, man. They they want to they want to cash out, man. Hear that? Just feed everybody, man. Come on. Mm. Let oh everybody eats, man. The family eats. Take I mean, up we'll see. Up that will be a we'll joke. see what they agree on. If they agree on something where it's we get to see Premier League football still, I'm happy. Because um, mm. I just like a game every single two weeks. That's a bit dead for me. Yeah. Oh yeah. You for mean me, it's just Super League? Yeah, for sure. That's for me, dead. That's, yeah, because then you won't end up watching those shit teams. Yeah. I think this is a clear move against UEFA, and UEFA brought all that into the party to help them. Yeah. So I helped them. Facts. Facts. Instead of we'll the, Champions, the Champions League, we've got Super League. Um, laughing. It, it, it is really bad for the clubs that are like the Leicesters and the West Ham's doing well, but boy. Yeah, that's funny. That's funny. Do this West for 20 years and maybe you can join this league in it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, City and Chelsea aren't allowed in then. We've only just Why, what do you mean? for 20 years. No, we've done it for more than 20 years. What are you talking about? Maybe we have. City ain't. Yeah, that might not be I'm happy it, with bro. that. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with your uh, new statement. <laughs> Everyone is cussing at Arsenal, but in the Super League, they'll always get good draft picks. Just because it's Super League, <laughs> there's not going to be a. That's There's not going to be a draft, draft guys. Do you know what I'm saying? Guys, the yeah, Super draft League would is, never work in England. Or... Jokes aside, jokes aside, yeah. The Super League is going to be a replacement for the Champions League. Um, there's going to be teams that are in it every single permanently in it, then other teams can qualify for it. UEFA and them should get involved. Get involved. Yeah, see, I hear for that. The maddest thing, the maddest thing, yeah, these teams will still be in the domestic leagues. So what's the problem? That's if it happens like that. Yeah, but that's, that's if, what okay. if, if, what, if, if what they want happens, they'll still be in the d- domestic league. So in that case, are you guys supporting it? Yeah, no. So yes. it, it, yeah, it, it oh, depends. Yeah. yeah, it depends on exactly what you're saying. Are you saying there's promotion relegation? No, oh, no promotion, no relegation. I didn't mention that. Okay. Still in the domestic leagues with promotion. Of... <laughs> I'm just trying to sleep in a bit. There's, so they're still in the domestic leagues that have promotion relegation. Mm-hmm. This replaces the Champions League. So this is our European content now. Mm-hmm. The best teams in Europe going against each other every fortnight for the whole season. So you can still do the domestic team. That is fine. But instead of the Champions mm-hmm. League, you got the European Super League. It's the which, biggest which, which, club, which, which the is biggest fine. club in Europe. That that's fine. I'm still against the closeness of the league. That, that's fine. Yes, that's why you still got the domestic league. The domestic league is your uh, promotion yeah, and relegation. In the, so in the domestic league, if let's say, let's say Arsenal just become a shit team, yeah. even though they've got money, yeah. but then for some reason they're still in that Super League. Why should yeah, they they'll, still be they'll, be, they'll be getting pumped because they're one of the biggest clubs in the world. Yeah, but like if they keep on being run badly and they keep on b- signing shit players, and that's it's the But what I'm saying is, there's clearly better teams that should be in there. I just think it'll be a better format you know, for the best teams to be in there. Oh, nah, I don't know, man. 
They'll of just buy you lots. Yeah, they'll buy you lots. They'll buy you lots players real quick, man. Not buy lots. Uh, the, 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 not you lots. So, but those, um, <laughs> look at you. You're hating from inside the club. But what I can say, um, people like somebody like Leicester, or oh, Fafana, yeah, we'll just swoop him up for 100 million. Shut up, man. That's what I'm saying about the Grealish thing as well. It's like Grealish ain't killing at Aston Villa anymore. The, the clubs have so the man, money. To all the them. serious players will be playing at Super League clubs. But don't that's you think it. that's? But don't you think that's like that will ruin even the Premier League because what it means is that no, no because because they're outside they're, the club. Yeah, but yeah. That, that doesn't. Really it's, it's a top six that dominate anyway. Yeah. It'll be just no, it shouldn't what you're saying happen it. anyway, though, realistically, in an ideal world, like Greedish should be playing for a top six club. It's not it's not guaranteed that it will happen like Yeah, that. but exactly, but this is this is the problem that the big clubs big club have is they are um they're not getting a bigger big enough piece of the pie. They're relative not. to they the should, relative they to the a business bigger, that like, so now they can't the take they, now they can't take players like candy from a baby because they made a kind of equalised system because, where... Do you know, yes, yeah, you but the equalised system is actually, when you look at it, it's unfair because they're not revenue drivers, these clubs. They're not revenue drivers. No, but but what, what the... Maybe I think one of the reasons why the Premier League is better than La Liga, etc., is because of this system, where it means that the growth of the league happens and not just the growth of some clubs. Okay, okay, I hear that. Yeah, that's all well and cute and all. I don't care, man. Look, let's just get this thing on board. Let's go. Let's I go. can't believe how it's possible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a rebuttal. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. That was a rebuttal. Mad, boy. Anyway. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, yeah, that's crazy. That's, <laughs> that's crazy, crazy anyway, bro. That's crazy, When bro. is Mbappé <laughs> coming to come anyway. back to Anfield too? Okay. You're still not going to get Mbappé. Interesting. This is going to be interesting now. <laughs> yeah, this is know, the war. There's a war. We're watching a war. For football, this is the new Brexit. Like, this is like if it's the vote, it's like which side are you on? Who do you think blinks first? Say it again. Who do you think blinks first? Well, I want to see this. And this announcement is supposed to be happening 9 30, and I want to see if they're going to double down and say, Yeah, we're doing this, or if they're going to say, Actually, etc. We've seen all this. I, I'm just interested in that because mm-hmm. if they're doubling down and they're doing it, it might be a thing where they go ahead with it and then later. Everyone says, you know what, we're going to comply and we're going to create these avenues where it can be an ecosystem and everything works together. But if they just butt heads, that'll be interesting. That'll be super interesting because I feel like that will be bad for us in terms of football fans. Because it might mean that we get a World Cup, but the players aren't playing in the World Cup. The best players aren't playing in the World Cup. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I... <sighs> Well, they, these, 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 the Eurofin that will, they will fall back, man. Yeah, we'll see. Anyone watching Leicester versus Southampton again? No. What, 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 what time is it on? What time? If, there, if, there, if there was a Super League, this would be Atletico Madrid against flipping Chelsea. Yeah, hello? <laughs> no, I don't, I don't, I don't, We've already I don't seen that. Work. We've already yeah. seen that this year. Yeah. Yeah. Then it'll be Chelsea. It'll then be Chelsea be against, against Juventus. Yeah, yeah something like Juventus that, yeah. against Manchester United, Arsenal against Inter. Come on, man! Why would you not want to see and, that? Right now? We watch it. We watching Shay Adams run it down, run it down the channel. <laughs> <laughs> What's I'm not sure about the name now. I'm not sure about Super League. I don't really like the way that, that sounds. That might just be code name, man. That, yeah. so why don't you like the way that sounds, brother? I think they need to repackage that. That's what? I don't know. I ain't. In marketing like that, but I don't like the sound of it. <laughs> You'll get used to it. Oh, you, what, what does it you know what I mean? You talk about right? that bum, you're a criminal, you know? You talk right, you be <laughs> <laughs> What kills me is okay, these guys are in the club. I bet you once the Super League starts, man, or oh, if you see Mason Mount stats in the Super League, fucking hell. Oh, what, what? 100%. 100%. <laughs> no, that's going to be sad. That's going to be sad. That's going to be sad. Yeah, I'm all over that. Mason Mount winning the last ever Champions League. Okay. Uh, uh, that's scary. We'll, we'll see. We'll that's see. a scary or, prospect. Or losing, we'll that'd be even better. <laughs> Liverpool, Liverpool, Liverpool had one bad season. They said, "Fuck it, Super League." <laughs> 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 yeah, I bet if you asked them last season, they would not have been for it. Yeah, nah, I'm yeah, alright, yeah. you know. I'm alright. just lucky this Super League happened this year, not kind of five years ago. Or they might we're not have considered. We're not lucky at all. Please, please, please. Liverpool. Look, I, 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 <laughs> if you look at if you look at Liverpool, Liverpool probably would have been invited because they've been doing yeah, the sure. anyway. <laughs> and they've got they Obviously, they would have. Yeah. yeah. yeah.
Come on, man. Heritage. Mm. Yeah, you said Harold, you sorted that one out, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pattern that quickly. So look, wait, wait, wait. You might not realise that the ve- the, one of the vice chairmen or vice presidents is John John W. Henry. Yeah. The, the, the owner yeah. of Liverpool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we would have been there regardless. Why is Florentino the big boss? Nah, I'm not happy, man. But, yeah, he's been, yeah, he's been pushing this for ages. Since 2000. This is his baby. Yeah, this is his time, baby. Yeah, he's time, different with yeah. that. But how, he's how he's many Champions he's Leagues... He's is a like he re- he, he realized I, I can't buy Mbappe and Haaland in the same song because of <laughs> yeah, you wait for fair play. Now nah, scratch yeah. this thing, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is why right, Pogba right, can't so... buy all three, all three of them. Yeah, this is why you have to think of them. Something everyone's like. Maybe one of them. Maybe two of them. Maybe two of them. <laughs> mm. so okay. Say, how many how many Champions Leagues equates to one Super League trophy? Three. Two. Mm. Two or three. three. Oh my God! Bit There's a Champions League tax now. Yeah. Thank you now. Champions League. Champions League. I can't lie, Rod. You just get me excited, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's go, man. This is franchise ball, bro. It's a franchise. The game has changed. Oh, you won. You won five Champions League. Yeah, it's Champions League, isn't it? It's not. We've got. We've got two Super Leagues. Come on. Why not, why not it, it resets it. It resets it. it means exactly, that exactly. <laughs> it resets you know what, it. Yeah? Oh, it resets it. Yeah. confirmed, yeah? Because that way we can officially say Arsenal have never, ever Ooh. won a Champions League. <laughs> yeah, all right, cool. And they yeah, will the never, over. ever. That, with yeah, that, that, that is cool. I'm, we're still on the guest list, though. <laughs> yeah. We're on the guest list. <laughs> Yo, don't yeah, ruin German Dan's day. It's annoying. It's bad, yeah, German Dan is bad. <laughs> 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 <Literally. laughs> all, all those years have been turned away at the door for wearing trainers rather than heart. Uh, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm in now, baby. Come on. I'm in now, man. <laughs> the tap is painful, you know. <laughs> Your boy German Dan's in the party. Come on, man. Why in the building? <laughs> Everybody outside the Super League, your club's a white. Come on, lads. <laughs> hey. I'm all right, man. <laughs> Big games every fortnight. Come on, man. That's what we're talking about. I'm, I'm sold already, man. I'm sold already. The best what? of the best. We always talk about this way. This guy's better than this guy. Thiago better than Pogba. Blah, 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 blah. Let's see them duke it out on the pitch, man. Who wants to watch the World Cup, man? Ghana almost getting to the semi final. What's that, man? <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, okay. Football. Proper football. Come on, man. How many times would they play each other a year? Like, yeah. these teams? Oh, where are they these inf- I'm seeing some tweets. Hold on. Twice, yeah. Hold on the way. You want to see the best players? You want to see the best players play for Charles? You want to see the best players play for Charles, son? Right, it's killing me. Do you know how just normally it's got that Pfizer check? Uh, it's yeah. like you've been right, are you man? Are you man seeing that world. with the players? If you go to Super League, we'll use the NBA model. The players will have free. Yeah, I saw that earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's go, man. No, this. Why do you not feel? Guys are still using away goals. That's an antiquated system. This is whoever scores oh, more. The incentive. The incentive on you is to score goals. Attacking, entertaining football. They get rid of VAR too. Come on, who, who's who's mad? Get the best refs. We'll have the best refs in one league. The 20 best referees. The best linesmen. Come on, man. <laughs> Most of the, the best, best linesmen. linesmen. <laughs> <laughs> the best linesmen, bro. The best linesmen mean oh, we don't need yeah. the AR, man. The best cameramen. The best cameramen. You seen that 4K? You seen that 4K uh, stuff on WWE? 8K cameras. Come on, man. Yeah. Let's get it cracking. Nah, man. Imagine the virtual reality in stadium experience oh. that Bezos will create. Come on. Oh, da- oh. Hey, Dan, Dan, Dan. I'm sorry, man. Mm. I'm sorry, man. Virtual reality in stadium <laughs> experience. What are you, doing, you nuts? Mariah is saying your dreams. Just everything Mariah is saying isn't going to happen. Look right, look right. Uh, uh, it, it may not happen, but it sounds nice. That's what I'm about. Nice. This is football. This is what we've been waiting for, boys, man. The best of the, the best. Future. This is it, man. And we still, and we'll still have the prem as well. So the best of both worlds, man. Yeah, yeah I, 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 I said ah zoo. I said ah zoo every week. <laughs> 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 oh, 
That's hilarious. I can't even lie. That's hilarious. That is so funny. That is so funny. Why are you saying it, Dan? Hey. You, actually, you know you can't spell Mariah without the word... You can't spell Maya without Mariah. That is I true. Mean, that I, is I, true. That was, that was awful delivery, but you, you get the joke. Thank you. Thank you. I was, I was going to say, actually... Oh, shit, I lost my train of thought. Fuck. It's the old days. It's the old days. Hey, this Super League is... I can't wait, man. I'm sold. I'm so sold. I'm sold, man. No, yeah, guys, guys. I'm not serious, man. I'm not serious, man. Mbappe versus Rashford. Harold. I'm not more serious, man. Yeah, guys. Look, how many how many quality games have you guys say that you've seen this year? In the season, how many? Um, I have a species, uh, all, all, all been in the Champions League, bro. That's yeah. leg of Real Madrid versus Liverpool. The real high quality game. Two. I like that. Was um, Clasico. Oh, Dan, you liked what Fulham versus West Ham, yeah? What, no, what are, you, are you talking about? Are you talking about in um, just the Premier League or Champions in, League? Too? In all, in anywhere, in, anywhere, in, in general, anywhere, in general, just football that you've seen this season. I don't know, man. I can't. Do you know what? Exactly, they're not even memorable, exactly. bro. Exactly. Yeah, you're, yeah, forgetting, you're, forgetting, you're, forgetting, you're forgetting the teams. I'm forgetting no, those teams, what, man. I'm saying for me, I like yeah. like Alejo versus Chelsea. I like those games. I can't remember if they were a good game for the neutral. Yeah. But but obviously because I'm invested and we got through, mm. those are the games that I kind of remember. Honestly, like, Chelsea against the spectacles. best players in the world. Do you want to see Chelsea rise spectacles. to the ascendancy? Spectacles for football. Everyone was talking about that Bayern PSG match. Mm. Um. I can't remember, but my memory's just bad. Do you know what I'm saying? It's not. No, it's not. Okay, but look, but look, okay, fine, Dan, cool. But even if you want to include Chelsea, hey, Chelsea fine. My, my point is that mm. this so we're, grasp, we're literally grasping at straws here to find games of high quality. <laughs> that ain't happening in the Super League. We get four quality games week in, week out, even in the league. That's we see Spurs versus Spurs, no, Liverpool versus United every damn year. Draw. I ain't, I ain't trying to see that, bro. Like I'm okay. I'm, I'm, I'm for good. reform anyway. I'm for reform. I'm not saying I'm not for. I'm for reform. So you'd be for it if there was a relegation and promotion. No. I just I wouldn't. I need to see how it is done. Forget if the relegation, it's... blood. Imagine uh, if you can't meet. The, wait, wait. Imagine if. Mm. Imagine you you get promoted and you can't pay the entry fee. No, you get paid. You don't. Pay oh wait, 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 wait. You, you you get paid. You get three hundred fifty. Well, hey, the first, hey, yeah, hey. the first guys they get three hundred fifty. Yeah, then then, the then even then even more so. Your hundreds are not getting in. Are you mad? Can you imagine Aston Villa with three hundred fifty mil? Nah, man, you're crazy. <laughs> Got Elijah on for the main pot. We're gonna sell you a lot on this Super League thing. Mwah! That's it, man. <laughs> We're gonna get our sponsorship money. I tell you that for free. Mm. Uh, Mariah is killing me. First official partners of the Super League. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen. If, if, if that's what we're going to do, that's what we're going to do. You know what, yeah? You know what? We used to start making so, relationships now. It'll be so funny, yeah? Because stuff will be the numbers. Be like, oh, fuck. <laughs> you, know, you know how with a chance the friend before the game, they do the lineup so that they've got like, the, the player doing a jokey sort of pose, then a serious pose. We'll all have our like jokey ones and we'll all have our serious ones. Like, and hey. that <laughs> Hey. The, money, the money's talking. <laughs> the money's loud. What are you saying, yeah? Shoot, 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 we are up at the price of the brick. Are you man bear laughing? I'm dead serious. On my mother back. We're dead serious. <laughs> oh gosh. Hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 so this is what um the is that the Bundesliga? The DFL opposes any concept of a European Super League. Economic interests of a few top clubs in England, Italy, Spain should not lead to the abolishment of st- structures in European football as a consequence. It would be irresponsible to irreparably damage the national leagues as a basis of European professional football. I therefore strongly support the joint statements of UEFA with the national association and leagues in England, Italy and Spain. Fair enough. Don't care, though. Let's go, man. Super League. <laughs> Bro, I ain't trying to hear all that. The, the Bundesliga are talking a load of rubbish. After Bayern, I, 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 it's true. It's true. 
It's true. They need to do it at their own house. Yeah. Oh, yeah. shit, we're going to have competition. Fuck. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they need to sort at their own house. For years, I'm, I've, been, I've been trying to say they need to get rid of this 50 plus 1 rule, man. They should. Because Hammer wouldn't be in the Bundesliga 2 right now, bro. With some, 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 some of them, um, Saudi Arabia would have invested in us, man. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> they even tried to buy us, bro. They even tried to buy us, man. The Bundesliga oh, wait, blocked them, man. Fuck support. them, guys. Yeah, you're a Hamburg supporter. So Hamburg. <laughs> really? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, Dan, you killed me, man. My days. Yeah, I can't lie, man. This just sounds. Bring amazing. me that. Bring me that Europa Super League, man. <laughs> Wait. Oh, that. What did you say? Oh, I thought you said Europa Super League. Europa. Europa. <laughs> the Europa Super League, you know. Oh man. CLI. Yeah. Why did um? Why did uh, Lou just post the roast, man? That's ridiculous. I said, oh, because, no, because we had less from a long standing conversation. I said, yeah. I've never had a Yorkshire, what was it? Yorkshire, pudding. what are they called? Pudding. Yorkshire pudding. And so you show me a roast, a Yorkshire pudding, a roast within a Yorkshire pudding. Like, look what you're missing out, mate. Guys, what, what channel is, is, is the FA Cup game on? BBC, it should be. It's on BT. There's no questions in time, boy. Let's get some listeners' questions. Super League only. <laughs> tweet out for it. Thank you, brother. <clears throat> Say Super yes. League only, yeah? yeah? Yes, I have definitely um, drawn a short straw with Hamburg, man. I respect your loyalty, bro. But your, your, your uncle played for Dortmund. I just don't understand. And Dortmund, Hamburg as well. Oh, oh hey. Hey. Okay, that makes sense. My bad, bro. Okay. Okay. Your listeners' questions. Specifically related to the... Joking, it could be whatever. Oh, <laughs> I think he's really on this, you know. No, 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 it could be whatever. I'm going to make this podcast elitist. Nah, it could be. It could be whatever. Send in your listeners. Mariah put the topics in, in, in the chat for the pod. Super League and Cats. Everyone wants to know what I'm doing. Listen, man, it's Super League time, bro. Let's do this. <laughs> Honestly, now nah, this senior this, man, this campaign that Mariah's put out, you would have thought he's been paid by the Super League already, bro. A hundred percent. A serious campaign. I'm impressed, Mariah. Bro. Very man. Very good. Bro, when we're in, when we're in it, you guys remember this day. You guys remember this day? Who supported it? Who didn't, man? Can you guys, can you guys imagine that? I'm so happy. I'm gonna catch so many L's. Listen, I only come on for Super League Discord. Oh, huh? you, man. Wow. <laughs> it's so funny. So we, had funny a former, yeah? we had a former panelist, and I remember when they were linked, uh, Barcelona was linked with Neymar, and he said it wouldn't work. Messi, Suarez, mm. and, and Neymar. And his name gets still brought up to, to like to this day. To this day. To this day. To this day. <laughs> he said it wouldn't work. And obviously, it's one of the You don't want to be on the wrong side of the Super League, brothers. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, yeah? Yeah. I can imagine, yeah, uh, Touchdown getting pulled as the... Uh, no, Touchdown getting chosen to be one of the partners for the Super League, yeah? And and then, obviously, you got all those previous tweets of Dan Mad Vex. <laughs> oh, I can't really get to that, yeah? And then you see... Clean, and then you see clean the whole time, timeline, man. And then you see Sof... And then you see Sof literally going on the pitch to present uh, Neymar with... <laughs> with the player, player of the tournament award, what? <laughs> and they're like, "Oh, is this you? Where is this you all around?" I've already deleted my account, bro. It's cool. I've sorted it. <laughs> yeah, I can't hey, lie. Listen, if, if they're to give me the bag, I'm deleting everything. This is Dan when we get that Super League bag. Look at him. <laughs> 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 it's true. Oh, man. <laughs> wait, hey, wait, hey, wait, George. We're right with her looking at that when it comes into the Super League Discord. Yeah, George. <laughs> hey. Oh, my God. Uh... That is funny. Nah, you might have on job oh, today, boy. I oh, my the days. Old PG version of that, uh, Kanye. Let me see if I can find it. Nah, you might have yeah, funny. Like, uh, oh, the weird stuff God. on the top. Hey, listen. When they get rid of these nonsense commentators as well, we'll be eating, man. 
Uh, no, you, you, guys, <laughs> you guys are so yeah, funny dying. today. Oh my god, uh, you're dying today. <laughs> It's true, I'm man. Really, we got, we got. Oh, guys, this is this is proper. Ah, would have liked. We need buy Sancho Howland. They're coming out of buying, man. I mean, out of Dortmund. We're chopping all the Bayern's players too, man. If you're not enjoying it, you're getting rolled over, man. I just want a league where they can. Over. Yeah, but I just want a league where they can win it every, every, every week. Mm. That'll be my entire. I'll be my entire job, Momars. I'll be, I'll be their pitch side. I'll be like. Oh, oh, we're just going to switch to Harold here for his height update. It turns out that Neymar <laughs> actually is... Neymar actually is 5'8". Back to the studio, guys. <laughs> 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 Wait, oh, my uh, God. And back over to you, Harold, up on the height. <laughs> yeah, oh, literally. Oh, my God. <laughs> but you really right, did it, right? right? I stood beside him. You know I'm 6'2". And he's roughly about up to my shoulder. So I'm saying five nine five eight. I'm gonna try and get him again at full time. But that's my that's my uh, number for now. I'm sticking with it. Hold out. <laughs> Hi, updates. My God. <laughs> oh, I was talking about in a group chat when like people are sending the game's gone. In my football team's group chat, someone's genuinely just put the game is gone. Babs, Babs was saying. Oh, hey, my God. Guys are fuming, bro. Yeah, I, was, I, was I can't lie to you. The game has only just begun. The game hasn't yeah. even started yet, personally. I don't know. I can't tell you why the game's gone. <laughs> 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 Oh, football is losing its identity, someone. No, 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 no. Fo- football is starting to create its identity. That's yeah. what you're saying. <laughs> I'm not oh, oh, my days. Maybe then to make up for a league season, what they play each other four times. Let's go, man. 48 game season. Imagine that. Imagine, imagine, uh, what's it called? Like, uh, the game decider, yeah? And then half time, half time, you got Drake coming out to come and do a performance. Imagine, imagine, imagine playing to watch PSG versus Bayern final, and you also get a Drake performance. I'm, I'm in for it. I'm in for it. I'm sorry. Oh man, half time show is gonna be Meek Mill. I used to play for times. <laughs> I used to grind like that so I can shine like this. <laughs> oh, they're man. imposters. They're imposters. They're nothing to do. The owners of this club, the owners of Liverpool, the owners of Chelsea, the owners of Manchester City, they're nothing to do with football in this country. There are hundred and odd years of history in this country. Mm, mm, mm. That have lived and yeah. these clubs. He yeah. is rattled. Listen. <laughs> you, don't need to, they, you don't need to put you know that you know that meme of Jamie Carragher and, and never walking away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you should put me and Harold. You should put me and Harold walking yeah, away. Yeah, funny. Walking away with their new Gucci suits. 100%. What? You should post us walking hey, away. Listen, Harold, did you see that message from JRJ? No, nah, let me see. I didn't see it. Let me see. <laughs> hey, I just replied to it just now. Check it. Check Jerome. Check, check, check the one I'm, I'm replying okay. to. Oh my days! Oh, <laughs> the chat is going crazy, bro. Hey, the chat. Listen, uh... hey, that that sofa. You you don't know, see the, the potential already. Look at you. I'm on mute, man. I'm can't, on mute. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Crazy. I can't. Touchline like going global. I can't lie to you. I I I can't lie to you. I look wavy in this yellow suit, boy. Are you mad? <laughs> <laughs> Are you actually mad? <laughs> You guys kill me, man. Oh, flipping hell. Oh, I can't believe this, man. This is it. This is actually. 
Okay. I need to go back to that pin tweet. I can't even like, where do I find it? Let me go to pin. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. Hey, I'm surprised. I, I've, not, I've not seen uh, any Shannon, um, Shannon Sharp content yet. Where you man at, man? It's true, you know. It's actually true. You might going to see me bringing out real life goats onto the pitch side. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, this whole I just listened to the Gary Neville stuff. And you that, yeah? You support him. No, I don't like I don't like what he's saying either, really, truly. Really. The way that he's got <laughs> no, nah, the way that he's going, it was like these guys, these new like Roman Abramovich, they're, they're nothing to do with football in this country and all that type of shit. I don't, I don't. Yeah, I know. I don't like what he's saying. It's, it's somewhere you in the middle. You gotta pick a side. You gotta pick a side, brother. <laughs> I'm four e four. I just, I, I'll I take a screaming time out. We give another penalty away. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I think I just need to read exactly where it is. I need to understand exactly where it is. Hey, I hear you, bro. They're saying announcement nine thirty today, so I'm I'm looking, mm. looking forward to what that actually. I, I thought it's I thought it's ten for you. Oh, yeah, ten thirty. It's been time. Yeah. Ah yeah. oh, man, they, they, they're not respecting land of duty, man. I don't know if I can back this. I don't know if I can back this. I'm watching land of duty first. Come on, man. Hey, listen. responsibilities, man. I ain't fucking bet. Man. Fucking yeah, I, worries, I, 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 I caught up the other day. That, man. Land of duty is really is is hot enough, bro. I, I that's was caught up that's finally. Pretty- that's Pete British drama right there. Nah, man. that that's actually hilarious. Imagine, imagine Bayern and and Dortmund both saying no to it, yeah, and then they, they call up Hertha Berlin, and, and Hertha Berlin <laughs> become the new Bayern Munich of the Bundesliga. They need to call up Hammock, man. <laughs> no, bro, bro, let go, let go, please, please, Never, <laughs> please, please. Yeah, big city, you know. Yeah, big city, small club. Nah, nah, but this club as well. <laughs> We've actually won the Champions League and shit. Have you actually? Did Kevin yeah, Keegan, did Kevin Keegan play for you? Yeah. No, no, no. You might won the European Cup, my guy, not the Champions League. But oh, what, what year was this? I like, I like hey, German damn BA, hey, man. Hey, we got, hey. We, we, we got, we got more European the, heritage than Spurs. Champions League, man. BA, man. League, man. We have more heritage in the Europe than Spurs. We should be in that league, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get two teams. I'm trying to get two teams. Dan, Dan, Dan. Ah, you know me. By that settlement, Dan. Dan, Dan, Dan. By that settlement, Nottingham Forest have more heritage than Arsenal. Should should they be in? Oh, really, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not, they're, they're not a big city, bro. I told you the city thing as well. What, what, who wants to go there, man? Not in Ham. Why? No, the way you were saying, not in Ham. They have no, they have no Hagerstown over there, man. No one wants to go there, bro. <laughs> Do they even have a piano uh, in, in them sides there? Nah, however, they do have bad bees, allegedly. Oh, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on, what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Allegedly, I heard, I heard. Okay. Yeah. Where did you hear this from? Yeah, we're going to need we're gonna need more. No, brother. man, not really deep down everything I say. I, I you can't just say, you can't just say that. Of course I can. Of course I can. You know what? Yes, you can just say something, but yeah, we want to know more, brother. Yeah, well, it's just it's it's more uni story, isn't it? A couple, a couple of friends. Okay, just just take, just take it, take it for what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Don't ask any more questions. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just know it comes from a trusted source. That's mm-hmm. it. Okay, okay, okay. okay. But, but I said Harold sources. Like <laughs> himself, you know, it comes from a trusted source. Okay, so it comes from me, man. This is hey, do, 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 do you know how brave yeah, he's gonna be? Man. Imagine, imagine, imagine transfer windows. What? Yo, yeah, yeah, the central winners are going to be great. The thing is with the, the Bundesliga clubs, I literally think it's just saving face at the moment. Man, yeah. says, yeah. Super, yeah. man, said, man says Super League should have storylines like WWE. Oh my days. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. oh my god, imagine if you do Amazon documentaries as well. Whilst they're in oh, that'd, be that'd be sick, that'd be sick, that'd be sick, that'd be sick. That'd be that's so cold, cool, yeah. I, 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 I want I want something like a salary cap. Just, just, just to keep the spread of players. Because the, the thing is, yeah, you have to remember, yeah, Madrid still have the heritage in it. So, if Madrid mm. come calling, listen, the, the players are gonna go. Hey, and, and, it, and if, you're, if you're telling me Madrid are doubling their money, hey, listen, say bye bye to Pogba, 
Say goodbye to Salah, say goodbye to Mane. Fam. All our players are growing, fam. But the thing, all though, growing. is that all the teams that we will be bidding for have the same money as well. So you just pay them it's more. It's true, but... It's true, but... They won't be able to... Players, players want to play for these clubs, isn't it? They won't be able to stockpile. Trust me. They'll be able to raid the non... Um, the non-Super League sides, for sure, but they won't be able to stockpile Super League talent. Don't worry, yeah. we're, we're, good, we're protected. Don't worry, man. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yeah, heritage, we're good, heritage. man. Yeah, we're good, we're good, man. Plus... Hey, you just got, you just got to like double check that. Because when you really this it, in order to watch Mbappe and Neymar, we have to watch him versus Strasbourg and stuff like that. Oh, oh, oh this is Mbappe. Man, 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 show. Man, talking about <laughs> Dev Knights in Krasnodar. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm tired of that shit. Of that shit man. Give me the top level football. That's what, that's what we're all here for at the end of the day. I can't lie, you right, bro. Like, who loses? Loses. That's what I want to know. Apart from those yeah. other clubs that aren't our like, clubs, who loses? Like, I'm in a group chat. I'm about to talk about, oh, I love an underdog. Guess what? You're an Arsenal fan. You're still going to be an underdog. <laughs> <laughs> in it, I have forgotten exactly who they are, man. Fun. I don't, you know I don't even like underdogs. That's the thing. I don't like underdogs. <laughs> <laughs> cool. We know, bro. We know. So, like, you haven't ever liked a fucking underdog story at all, boy. Fall in line. Fall in line right now. Yes. <laughs> Let oh, the elite fine. be elite and do your job. Yeah, you right. make up the numbers, but don't don't try to do too much, man. Yeah, now nah, Super League is gonna pop off, man. Hey, I can't lie. I'm so, I'm, I'm excited, man. I'm ready. I'm ready. Well, I'm already getting my. I'm already ordering my Super League memorabilia, man. <laughs> hey, what's a Super League right. memorabilia? Like, and you know what the sick thing about it will be is. <sighs> I'm you'll off. still have the you'll have the Premier League clubs as feeder clubs now. So oh, if you, you've got top talent. I'm taking. Yeah, it, I'm taking it. I'm taking it. Once once the P is there, hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, Grealish come here. You we see, you forty you mil. Yeah, yeah, we we just pay that quickly. <laughs> mm. Oh, I need that. <laughs> I'm still not sure this will happen, man. It just it just seems like a mad thing. But let's see what the announcement is on that. Yeah, let's see, man. Let's hey, see. man. Ah, oh, these two accounts are killing me. <laughs> Gary, Gary never talking about greed, you know? You work for Sky Sports, big man. What the fuck are you doing? You're part of the 1%, you pussy. Oh, you oh, see like, what I just said? That's a cost, cost of the Mbappe ladder, ladder match. <laughs> <laughs> Well, hey, legacy um, matches become become a whole different thing now. Uh, <laughs> I saying it's a legacy game for Harry Kane. Yes, it fucking is. He's playing Real Madrid for the fourth time in a week. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh man. Mm. Hold on. What the um? I'm just reading some tweets. What um? How did the Premier League get formed in this current format? They broke off. They broke off from the Football League. Hmm. The new G League. Facts. I can't lie. I'm reading tweets. I, I... Hey, what, what are you saying, Moray? You're, you're, you're sending them... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sending guys to Everton to get wrecked. Man, man, man that's Shorey Terry to go, go, go get wrecked at Leicester, man. <laughs> and Hannibal Medry taking at Everton, man. Yeah, we can go do your team. Go do your team. Come on, let's get it, man. <laughs> so twenty, so twenty clubs, fifteen permanent. That's uh, that's fine with me. Those five clubs, I'm guessing, are the top t- one from England, one from Spain, one from Italy, one from Germany, one from France. Hmm. Makes sense to me. Yep, makes a lot of sense. <laughs> I read a tweet that was like um, the Premier League have forgotten that about their pay per view nonsense they tried to set us up with. Bro, they're all in it for you know what I mean for money, man. Yeah, like, yeah, it's definitely. so true. It's so true. Like, bro, don't forget they tried to do pay per view fifty pound a game, bro. Fuck the Premier League sometimes. Sky Sports are funny. They just know they're losing. It. They're losing our yeah, money. Sky that's what they're in trouble. Yeah, because they know they won't get it. That's what. That's why they're pissed. 
because they built up their own system, isn't it? So their media machine, they're gonna go against this because it's against their investment. <clears throat> yeah, the, league. They, well, the Premier League's on, on based off them, isn't it? Mm-hmm. So they're yeah, they're pissed for that reason. They basically... We love it, man. Boy, Sky Sports gonna have to pay back some money, boy. <laughs> You gotta hop on that Super League wave, bro. Taking enough from us, man. Mm. Gonna have to hop on that that Super League wave, bro. Hey, that 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 Super League broadcast deal is gonna be a mad thing. Yeah, the all that broadcast deal. Whoever whoever gets it. That broadcast deal is gonna be a mad. Yeah. I can't wait, boys. Let me hop off main pod, then call a a line of duty, then then be back on here for the announcement. I love it, boys. Yeah, man. Why? Why are we recording early? Because we're not watching the FA Cup. And there you go. If there's any other justification for your Super League, there it is. Mm-hmm. All right, brothers. Nice one, man. Speak to you in a bit. All right. Peace. Peace. Yeah, peace. I'm